everybody hello hello welcome in everyone happy saturday it's saturday and we're thriving um how are y'all doing hello kai hello alia welcome in how are y'all hello besticle how are y'all doing hope everyone's having a nice weekend so far um i hope everyone's been if you were in melbourne i hope you've been staying cool it's gotten weirdly hot out of nowhere I'm sorry, it's the middle of March. I've been wearing a jacket to work. And then today it was like, <laughs> just a casual 37 degrees. Excuse me, what? 37 degrees, but also um, cloudy. Very confusing. Kyle looks pretty on you. Thank you. The hair. The hair. I did get my hair done today. Um, and thank you. <laughs> You know what's weird is it does not look this colour uh, in person. It looks darker. Yeah, but thank you. I'm nice and summery because of the 37 degree heat. I was like, I'm not wearing sleeves today. Um, but this colour is, it's more the, the brown. It looks more purple in this light. I guess there's like a red tinge. It's like chestnutty, chocolatey. I got my hair done today. Um, that was my big thing. Um, on Friday at work, everyone was like, what are you doing on the weekend? And I was like, getting my hair done, finally. I haven't had an appointment since December, which for me is a really long time. I usually go, well, I usually go every like six to eight weeks to get my color touched up. Um, so this felt like a long time, um, but I just had such a nice time. I'm really happy with how it looks. It's nice and shiny and healthy. Um, I wasn't tempted to go blonde. I'm really proud of myself, really proud. Um, I was tempted to get like the curtain bangs everyone's getting, but I don't think my hair is ready to like change just yet. I'm just trying to ride out the brunette, enjoy it. I'm growing it a bit, but I did get it chopped, you know. She was like, how much do you want off? And I was like, I just have fun. <laughs> Chop until it looks healthy, which is dangerous because my hair is very unhealthy at the moment. Um, hello, Fee, welcome in. I hope you're doing well. But I'm so happy with how my hair feels right now. It feels really smooth and glossy and healthy, um, which is nice. I just love, like, I just love the hairdressers. I'm a hairdresser girl. I love being at the hairdressers. Um, do you, do you, without hair, I could not go bald. I don't think I could go bald. I don't think I have the head for baldness. <laughs> I don't know. I've done the app, like the filter on TikTok. It didn't look great. Um, looks so good. Thank you. It feels really good. I'm um, like and say, love your hair. Looks amazing. Thank you so much, butterfly. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. No, it feels really good. It feels really fun and healthy. Um, what is this lighting doing? Um, and just like a nice change and just straightening. It was always good. It's so funny. When I was blonde, I always curled my hair. Like I always curled it. And I'm really looking. <laughs> like I always curled my hair when I was blonde. I like. I didn't like it unless it was curled. But then with the brunette, I don't like it when it's like properly curled. I'm like, no, 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 I have to like straighten it or like blow dry it. It's so weird. Like the color affects how I style it, but no, nah, but I'm glad everyone likes it. I'm really happy with how it turned out. It was like my whole day. My hairdresser is like an hour away from my house, like an hour drive. Used to be 20 to 30 minutes. Now it's an hour, maybe more. Today was probably a little bit more than an hour. It was like an hour 15. But I'm like, I can't change hairdressers. Like I can't, it was a whole day, yeah. It was, well, it was not a whole day. It was just like the whole hour to like get there. Like I had to wake up and like have breakfast, have my coffee. And then it's like, it took 30 minutes. No, well this, this actually took like probably three hours total. Um, I would say this took about three hours. Cause I've got to do the whole color and I've got to set it. And then they've got to like, they do the, um, like the hair treatment because my hair is not very healthy at the moment. And then they had to style it and cut it. So it takes a couple of hours. I don't know how long your hair appointments take, but mine take a while, um, which is what I want. I don't want to do, I don't want to be in, in and out in 30 minutes. That's not enough time for gossip. And I'm in there to gossip. Uh, you're the one crying, not me. Lily Mae, are you enjoying, um, have you played the new pack yet? I'm so excited by the way. I literally only installed Growing Together like today. So I had pre-ordered Growing Together. I had pre-ordered it, but I hadn't had a chance 
to turn on my computer when it since the game came out. I haven't had time since yet. I think it was released at like 4 a.m. yesterday, Australian time. And I don't know what I was doing yesterday, but I didn't have time to turn the computer on. So literally today I was like, oh, dip, I need to quickly jump in. <laughs> I need to like, I need to get organized. Um, but it has loaded, it has installed. I've updated, I think, as many mods as I can. And I've kept out any mods that aren't updated as far as I know. I also haven't played any of the updates, so we've like, we've barely touched the update. We played it for like 30 seconds on Thursday. But I haven't seen any infants, so we're going to really be thrown in the deep end. And I'm excited. I'm excited to be bombarded with like both update and expansion. I'm not going to know what's what. I'm, I'm going to have no idea what comes from the update and what comes from the expansion. <laughs> And that's okay. Move the moccasins out of their house and stole it for my Anna so Barry, you know what? Honestly, good thinking. I haven't seen it yet. I haven't seen the house, but I would say that's probably a good idea. Um, I'm so keen though. I'm we're gonna jump in because I'm so excited. I'm nervous, but I'm excited. Um so if we jump over, look, it's right here, it's already loaded. I'm so organized. I had the screens ready and everything. I'm really proud of myself. Um, we know that not sometimes we have a, a black screen, um, but growing it together, it looks so cute. We have the milestones, family requests moving in. Do I have to? We are not doing hundred baby today. <laughs> I'm holding off on hundred baby. We're gonna jump into my other legacy. Um, uh, the legacy that we haven't done for a while. We're going to jump back into Sophie's story. Sophie's like our casual legacy that I, I don't have like a solid plan for. Um, we're just kind of like vibing, but I'm going to kind of use her legacy to explore the pack because she's sort of like our storyline, our storyline gameplay. We're just kind of like vibing. I know, Sophie. We're going to like check out Sophie. We're going to see what happens. Um, a blast from the past, truly. She's barely even done anything, honestly. Um, but she's she's there. I remembered her. And I remembered her name. And she has a daughter with a name. <laughs> maple? We have a maple in the 100 Baby Challenge, but I think we also have a maple in this legacy as well. Um, but she is truly a blast from the past. But I thought she would be cute to use for this challenge. And we can, like, explore... The social dynamics. We'll see what happens. Um, and yes, the this pack is I think fifty dollars Aussie dollars. Um, so it's a little price. I don't I don't agree with the pricing of the expansion packs. I don't think they should be fifty dollars. They used to be thirty, didn't they? They've gone up. Um, um, will you ever do not so berry? Will I ever do not so berry? I started. Listen, listen, listen. <laughs> I started the Not So Berry Challenge literally when I started streaming. Like one of my one of the first things I ever did when I streamed three years ago was the Not So Berry Challenge. Um, hang on, let me just. I can show you. I can show you. They're in here. We well the way they look. There we go. One of them. Is, the Rose Generation went bold, and I can't fix it. Look, not so very challenge. <laughs> there she is. There's the little minty and the little rose, and that's as far as I got. And I haven't played that since 2021. So that's fun to know. Um, I also started doing the Not So Very Challenge again. I restarted with a new sim on my YouTube page um, and I've only done one episode. So I'm really slacking, but I do want to get back into it. Um, now that I have more time, I actually need to like finish editing the second episode and then I'm going to be doing the Not So Very Challenge over on YouTube as like a YouTube little like Let's Play series. Um, but, oh my gosh, we have so many goodness gracious this is all my save files <laughs> um where are we where is she there we go legacy let's go mcqueen sophie mcqueen throwback 
Um, I have sad news and good news. Oh, no. Quick, hit me with them both. Give me the sad and then the good. That's what we like to do. Boom, boom. Down and then up. No. Yeah, down and then up. <laughs> um, where are we? Oh, we're here. And I also want to redo this house because I don't love the house. But let's quickly have a look at San Sequia because maybe we'll even move over here. We could relocate. We could relocate. Um, when we're playing the 100 baby challenge, we are going to hold off on the baby challenge for a little bit. I'm waiting to see how the baby challenge is going to work with infants because I'm nervous as heck. Uh, so we will do the baby challenge probably soon. I'm just waiting to see what people kind of are suggesting. Now that we have infants, like I don't know how that's going to work. When can I age them up? How long do I have to deal with an infant crying over tummy time? I don't know. Um, also, this is a cute world, but this map is mostly water. So that's fun. What do we have here? We have Anchor Point Wharf, a downtown with a movie theater. I cannot wait to go to the movies. Um, even though I'm pretty sure it is just a rabbit hole, but that, you know what? That's fine. I don't mind rabbit holes. Um, so we have the abode. Oh, it's a rental. That's cute. Okay, you can rent there. The library. And then, oh, where's the cinema? Okay, mm, cool. Um, oh, so they passed away. Oh, I'm so sorry, Lily Mae. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, I hope it was peaceful. The robes, Ro robbles, the robbles. Living in the quake zone. Oh gosh, that's dangerous. Um, Gilbert Gardens, owned by Gilbert Gilberts. What a name! Who would name their child Gilbert Gilberts? That's like John Johnson or something. That's. I mean, you know what? That actually, that's probably there. Probably are John Johnsons out there. So. Um, apologies if your name is John Johnson. Um, good news, adopted a baby budgie and named him Pomet. Oh, that's the best news. That's so cute. A little baby bubby. Baby budgie. <laughs> baby bubby. Baby budgie. Oh my god, why can't I speak? Um, but that sounds very cute. What do we have here? We have an empty house here. Which house? Did everyone build? Okay, I can see the house that I'm up. I'm assuming, I'm going to assume that little Simsy built this house down here because it looks like a little blue suburban. So I'm assuming she built that. <laughs> um, I know, I think, didn't Deligracy build a house as well? She built a lot. She built something. I don't know what. There's the Robles Runo. Oh, okay, we have Laura. Can we, do we have info? There's a lot of, that's a lot of info. That's too much for me to read. Look, she built the library. Oh, she built the library over here. I see. And then we have the Michelson's house here. Very nice. Hey, look at this. Ka-chow. ka, -chow. ka -chow. Hello, Rim. Welcome in. Hope you're doing well. ka -chow, indeed. Okay, this is cute. This is a cute little area. So this is like a little homey, homey area. Very nice. Well, we're going to have to visit this area, but we're going to go back to Willow Creek. Did you do something with your hair? I did do something with my hair. I got it colored and just a brown again. Um, it looks darker, which is weird because I actually went lighter. <laughs> but the lighting is being a little dramatic. Um, but yeah, I dyed my hair. I, I was at the hairdressers for a couple of hours today. Uh, I had the best time. Um... I also want to, oh, she's a, it is Maple. I was right. It's Maple and Jules. I kind of wish that Maple was an infant. <laughs> that would kind of, wish it like a baby. That would have been good. But um, I would like to managing cats. Can we just edit? I want to like maybe, I want to check out the new cats items. She have lines? How old is she? You are not old enough to have lines, Missy. You only had one child. 
Isn't she a young adult still? No, she's a an adult now. Okay. Um, looks good. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate that. My little pomades already stood on my finger. That sounds so cute. That sounds very sweet. Okay. Can we go style? Growing together. What do we get? That's cute. Oh, I like that. It's like very like um I like the different colors. Like a nice little plain dress. Oh, I like that swatch. And then we have that. That's nice as well. It's kind of cozy. That's cute. Um, Pomet, Pomet is Lily Mae's little budgie. Her little budgie. Her new budgie. This is cute. That's, this kind of looks pajamery, but that's nice. A nice little dress. That's cute as well. And that's kind of, oh, I like this one. I like that. Well, these are cute. Okay. Um, what about the new tops that we got as well? Did we get any new tops? We must have. Okay. Oh, we got some nice stuff here. This is some nice outfits. I like the variety. There's like a nice variety of stuff. Um, we should got the dress without the cardi. Yeah. This is the thing. I wish we had this top without the cardigan. That little under cardigan I'm not loving. A little like turtleneck, sorry. The tur yeah, I'm not loving the turtleneck, honestly. I could do without the weird turtleneck underneath. Not a fan of that. Although she does look good, but I'm not a fan of it anyway. We have a nice little basic tee. Um, girl, put some pants on, please. Put some pants on, please. <gasps> okay, these are cute. Oh, we got some little like cutlets, or whatever they're called. They're cute. Um, Budgie, I got this new pal for Venturi. Older Budgie passed away yesterday. Pom, it's also the name of the Wicked's Ewok son in Star Wars. Oh, very nice. Saturday, not prepared to feel these emotions. It's a lot of emotions for Saturday, but we're riding like lows and highs. We're riding lows and highs. And we're glad that um, that Venturi has a new pal, a new buddy. These pants are really cute. This hat, actually, this whole outfit is really cute. Sophie's looking kind of cute right now. She's looking like a little cute mum. She's not looking like a little, like, real housewife, which is a problem, but that's okay. Actually, these are all really nice. This is this is just too casual, though. This is too casual for... I mean, we're not going to save any of these. We're just going to quickly, like, explore them. Um... Yeah, see, again, that would just... Don't, we don't need the cardigan. <laughs> we don't need the cardigan. Um, have you seen Little Shop of Horrors? I haven't seen Little Shop. You know what's really embarrassing? As a musical theatre person, I haven't seen Little Shop of Horrors. I know it. I know a lot of songs from it. But I haven't actually seen it myself. Actually, I think this dress could work for her, actually. Oh, that's cute. Wait, I like that. That's a cute little outfit. Look at her. That's very cute. Um, so embarrassing. It's so embarrassing for me. I know Little Shop of Horrors. It's, it's a crime. I have committed a crime. Please don't cancel me. Please don't cancel me. Please don't call the theater police. I beg of you. Um, listen, I know songs from it. I know Little Shop of Horrors. <laughs> I know Suddenly Seymour. I know the other songs. I know things. Listen, there's a lot of musicals out there, okay? There's a lot of them. And I don't know all of them. I do my best, okay? I'm doing my best. Um, you know, I was a theatre major, not a musical theatre major. So that's got, you know, there's points in there for me somewhere. Did you have to, it was peaceful death. He was asleep, heard of that, and he was perma sleeping. Oh, so he fell asleep. He passed away in his sleep. That is a nice, peaceful way. Sad, but hilarious. 
Life is a tragedy when seen in close, but um, close up, but comedy in long shot. Charlie Chaplin, amen. Beautifully said. See, this, I said this looked like pajamas, and it's literally under pajamas. Okay. Um, so we have, that's kind of just all the new outfits. This is cute. I will say this look is cute. Maybe in a different swatch. Yeah, I like that swatch more. This is cute. Nothing new there. Okay. Um. Now I need to go back to what her original outfit was, because I don't want actually. I don't actually want to change her outfit. I just wanted to have a little squeeze. That was all. Can we go all the way back? <laughs> Is it worth it? I don't know what she was originally dressed in. I don't know what she was wearing. Yeah, you know, we can keep her in this for now because I do like this look. I want to look at the new hair though. Show me the new hair, not all of my CC hair, please. Okay, so we have this. That's cute. And then we have a different hairband. Wait, yeah, okay. Um. She got the right curves. She do. She do. Funny to me, because normally I hear from the head that if you fell off the perch trying to fly, I thought it was that. But you were like, oh, he did. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you were like, he's not trying to fly. He's already fl flown. <laughs> oh gosh. Um, but I'm glad you had your nan with you, though. I'm glad that you were able to um, cry with your nan. This hair is cute. It's vaguely Karen, but also kind of like, it's very mummish. This is like very like mum hair. I like it. And then we have the gray. Oh, that's cute. And then we have this. These are like not really appropriate for her, but I like the hair. That's cute. This is cute. I like the little bob, like with the little top knot. She's just like a whole different person, isn't she? Man, hair really transforms a sim, doesn't it? That's nuts. Okay. What am I doing? Let's get back to her normal hair. Although now I'm kind of thinking I should just change it up for fun. Um, mum mixed with speak to the manager. It really is like half mum, half speak to the manager, which is kind of alarming. But, you know, good for her. There we go. I've included more POC hairs. Me too. I think it's like so needed. And it's like, it's good that we don't have to rely on, on you know, on CC as much because that's kind of where people have had to go. And that's also great for people who play on console. Like if you play on console and you want to have like POC character, like Sims, it's a little bit harder, but it's, they're really like actually starting to be more inclusive now, which is exciting. Um... Okay, so we've kind of like breezed through that. What else do we have? We have new faces. Oh, now we have like little scars. Well, we don't need a scar, but like that's cool. And we have this. This is so cute. I'm sorry, this is like so sweet. Anyone doing like a playing through the ages? Like they're set. They're set for whatever era this look is from. <laughs> they're set for that specific era. They're ready. That's cute. I love it. What else do we have? Accessories. We have like a necklace maybe. Maybe? No, that's not it. What's new? Do we have anything new? I don't recognize the symbol yet. Um, Do we get anything new? Hang on, pack. No, okay, that well, just was showing up for no reason. That's fine. Um, Do we get any new shoes? We so rarely get new shoes. No, we didn't, great. Um, 
I guess he's not having to conform to white ways. Big up. It's my people. Big up. Big up. Big up. I love people not having to do that. Finally. Pomma's actual birthday. Pet Shop, he said he was born on the 18th of January. Aw, <gasps> cute. I love actually knowing your pet's birthday. I don't know Lily's birthday. I've had to, like, decide for her, which feels weird. It feels weird to be like, I've decided to do a birthday. But I did. I picked it. And it is April, which is coming up. Um, okay, what did you get, sir? You got some new clothes. He got lots of new clothes. Ooh. I might actually start dressing my male sims. That's fun. That's really cool. I, I love this. <gasps> Wait, the men got a lot of new stuff. Hold up a minute. This is so cute. Oh, wait, actually, this looks kind of nice. I quite like that. Um, of course, Lily didn't tell you her birthday. Classic Lily move. Honestly, classic Lily move. Like, Lily was just so, con like, secretive about her birthday. Like, the adoptive people were like, yeah, we think it's February. But then, like, all of the registered things, like, all of her paperwork said, like, March or April. It was conflicting. She was giving me like different birthdays. I was like, what are you hiding from me? Like, what are you trying to hide? It's just a birthday. It's okay. Like, just pick a day. And then she didn't. So I picked one for her instead. Oh my God, there's so much men's clothing. I'm overwhelmed. And he looks dope in all of them. Um, He's a baby, baby, baby. You're going to try and get him used to being handled before he lives with Mr. Venturi? Good idea. Maybe her birthday changed over her other lives. Maybe Lily's birthday is just like changing every life, but she keeps them all. That makes sense. That, that checks out with what I know about Lily. And I know a lot because I spend every day with her. Um, stuff I would wear. Honestly, this is like really cool. I am actually going to start dressing my male sims with more attention. Like, look at this. He looks so cool. He looks like a little cool dad. And he is a cool dad. Did he get new hair as well? He did. Wait, whoops. <laughs> no hair for you, sir. Sorry, no hair for you. Um, <laughs> whoops. There we go. Okay. Um, you have hair again. What does he got? They got so much hair. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Wait, that really suits him. Didn't tell you her birthday since she didn't. Lily May, she didn't tell me that her birthday was tenth of September. She never mentioned September. She was hiding that one from me too. How embarrassing! Sorry, I just whacked the microphone. Um. Sims is catching up. Sims is really catching up. I kind of want to refresh my wardrobe. I think I'm going to like dress myself in the Sims and then go and try and buy that. These are all, oh my goodness. I love all of these. Like I love this. I love this for him. And like these as well. What does he normally have? <laughs> What's your hair normally look like, sir? I don't know why I called him sir. Didn't need my ears anyway. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what does he normally have? He normally has this. Well, you know what, Jules? We're going to give you a little upgrade. I think that's cute. I like that. I like this whole change. We're giving him an, a wardrobe update and no one else. That's fine. Mm, yeah, sure. Everything else is fine. You actually, don't you don't need a sweater. Let's give you an actual top in the hot weather. Um, okay. Now, little Maple is a toddler, so we don't get to explore the the tiny, tiny things. But oh, she's got the little two different eye colors. I forgot. <sighs> did we get new toddler hair? We did. We got like little matching hair. With the bows that have glitched, that's fine. <gasps> this is cute. These are so cute. 
ignoring the glitchy bows at the back of her head. <laughs> oh, wait, I love this. Okay, you know what? We're going to have to... Um, where are the bows? Where are they? They're there. Okay. I think we have to give her this hair because this hair is so stinking cute. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, she's having this hair. That's not even from this pack. That's from that's from the high school years pack. Oops. No, she's not having that cat. She's having this one. This is this is little maple now. Oh, but yeah, it is. She's getting a little makeover. Does she have new clothes as well? Oh, this is so cute. Look at the little ruffles. Are you kidding me? Oh, she's absolutely having this outfit. Oh my goodness, this colour, she's adorable. She is the moment. I'm giving her some new shoes as well. Oh, honey, you've had an upgrade and you are god dang adorable. She is potentially going to be my favourite ever, like, little legacy heir because she's so cute. Okay. Um, and the rest of her, yeah, the rest of you, you're rocking your other outfits, you're fine. Oh, hang on, I've got to get rid of the bows. <laughs> I gotta get rid of the bows. No bows, sorry. Um, where are the bows? Are they here? Hats? No, I want her to have the sun, the glasses though. Okay, you're fine. Okay. She's good. She's good. She's cute. She's set. Um, we might just... The thing is, I can't remember what her initial outfit is. I don't really want her to keep this outfit necessarily because this isn't really Sophie. It is, but it isn't, you know? Oh, it's okay. She does have her other outfits. To be fair, she does have her second outfit. And her third outfit. <laughs> I forgot about this. Hello. This is when she's hanging out with the real housewives. This is the real Sophie. But this is also mummy. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, she's a real housewife, but only in this outfit. The rest of the time, she's just vibing like this. Um, no, I really like that top, though. Can we give her maybe... I think I do like the pants as well. Yeah, I like that green. This is like her true self, but then she like glams up. Oh, I'm, yeah, okay. And then the rest of them are set. All right, we're also going to have to probably change the house up. We're going to have to give the house a bit of a makeover, to be honest. Um, oh, my God. <laughs> Look, okay, can we just... Can we just appreciate the massive clan of goth family right now? The goths really are making an empire. One, two, three, four extra kids. One, two, three, four, yeah, four. Plus Cassandra and then, and Alexander. The land grabs are also trying. I don't remember when they, um, when did Nancy age? Okay, good for you. Um, God saying ever James. <laughs> and we also have the Bjergsons have a lot of kids as well. There's the real housewives are really powering through, truly. Um, all right, let me just check my lifespan option that I'm playing on. Normal, yes, good, okay. All right, let's jump in. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to have to change the house up. I don't love the house. I've never loved the house. I can't build. So maybe we'll move or maybe I'll try and learn how to build. Is there a child crying? No. It's not the worst. It does need a clean. Goodness me. 
This house does need to probably be demolished at some point. There's, is there a roof? There is a roof. Okay. So she's a little basic box. She's a little basic box, to be honest. She's not that cute. I don't love her, but that's okay. That's okay. That's fine. Now, Symology, I need to have a look at this actually. Does she, she won't have any traits yet, but she does have, <gasps> wait a minute. She's already got milestones. She already has milestones? I didn't realize she already had milestones like loaded already. Well, that's exciting. Had a baby, fell in love with Jules, got married, became best friends with Bella, Bella her bestie. Oh, that's really cute. Okay, what have we got here? You don't have, learned the ways of the Lou. She hasn't learned, she hasn't read a book yet. Oh, this is so cute. Learn to walk, learn to climb stairs, where? Learn to dance. Oh my goodness. I'm actually gonna have to like pay attention to Maple. <laughs> um, we also don't have like, if anyone's wondering, we don't have a set rules. This isn't like a particular legacy challenge. This is just kind of where we vibe and we maybe pay attention to the wants if we can um and we are trying to have a couple of real housewives um like meetups so we need to meet up with the girls at some point maybe we'll do that at some point where are you by the way where is he oh he's just having a sad bath why are you having a sad bath all right dude to promotion. I know he doesn't like his job, but like, that's not my problem. And he doesn't have a best friend. <laughs> he doesn't have a best friend yet. That's fine. Uh, speaking of the book club, the book club. That's a great question. The book club. I've literally made the category. I've made, whoops, the, we have a book club. I just need to like load the book club. Um, I will... Be getting that organized soon i just need to work out the rules i'm i'm just you know what i always struggle with rules with roles in discord like doing discord roles is something that i am just not good at working out um so i need to figure that one out um but once i've worked out how to organize the like to allocate the roles then we can launch our little book club and it is going to be a cozy book club i'm still also working out like a little cozy name um is he now crying yes okay great well listen dude you need to get yourself together because you need to work in it so you can be fabulously wealthy and have a mansion um he's gonna browse the web you can't she's here actually she can paint let's have her do a little painting and you're sleeping. Okay. Um, I cry if I work in IT. You know what? Um, to be fair, same. I don't think he really wants to work in IT. I don't think Jules is really an IT guy, but like, you got to make the money. Tech support would kill me. <laughs> I, you know, it was so funny. The other day when I was working, we had no, so I work at a school and there was like a big school event on um that movie was pretty scary <laughs> i don't want to talk about it the movie because then people start doing the georgie bit at me and that's you know what that's terrifying i'm not impressed i'm not a fan of that at all um What's the time? It's 7.30. Night on the town. Everything's free. We should go and visit a venue. Wait, I want to go and visit a venue. We we can take the baby with us. We can wake her up. She can be woken. Um, we're going to go and have a night on the town. 
Um, only co co actual qualification is in IT, but I don't tell anyone. <laughs> Are we not anyone? Yeah, we're not anyone. Anyone at work. Yeah, don't tell your co-workers that you have like a qualification in IT. Do not mention that. I would not recommend that at all. No. But when we had like, we had all the, our, all, so the other day at work, all of the like teachers and all of these students were like off campus. And I ran into our IT guy and I was like, oh, are you having a quiet day? Like, is it a little bit quieter today? And he was like, no, not at all. Everyone keeps calling me, everyone's computers are broken. And I was like, there's no staff here. What are you talking about? And then I was like, oh, it was the rest of us like admin. <laughs> Everyone else was breaking their computers, not me. I already broke my computer and it's been fixed. Um, I actually, no, I didn't break my computer. The software broke itself and I just happened to be the next person to use it, which was not great. Um, I want to go to the cinema. But there's not really anywhere to eat. Maybe we'll just eat somewhere else. Do we have anything over here we can eat at? Yes, we do. I love when I plan things. Let's go to a restaurant. Oh, actually, do we trust a restaurant? I don't trust a restaurant and I want to check out the new area. Because isn't this where the cinema is? We could go here and then find food nearby. Let's go to the library. All right, let's all go to the library. Cinema isn't clickable, only findable. That is inconvenient, but that's fine. Anyone that annoyed me because the wireless mouse isn't working, the problem was that it wasn't wireless. <laughs> yeah, that, that's the problem. I can understand how that would be inconvenient. Um. Oh, knock knock, look at me achieving goals. Okay. So we have a cute little library, but I want to go elsewhere. I want to go to the movies. Where are the movies? This looks like a movie. A movie? This looks like a cinema. Oh, also Nina is going to buy an outfit that we did. Amazing. Incredible. We will sell that. Achievements? Honestly, pop off to me. See, who says I don't achieve anything in this game? You can't say that because I just went up to 25 different locations. Okay, so we found the cinema. Oh, because I'm a toddler? Mm, that would do it. <laughs> Why can't children let toddlers watch movies? Give them rights. Um, okay. I also, technically, we need to try and find food first for the nut on the town. Is there anywhere to eat? I guess you can brew coffee. Is there any food stalls around? I love a little food stall. There's a random piano. That's cute. Sometimes there's like random food stalls just like around. Ooh. That's just part of the cinema. Okay. Toddlers don't understand payment methods. I mean, you don't have to pay. You could just like vibe. Quirk Revealed loves books. Maple is the best toddler. Confirmed. She's a little... A little reader. Um, oh, food. Found food. Okay, everything is free. Amazing. Let's get some taquitos. Um, and you can have some egg rolls. And you can't order anything because you are a child. <laughs> Who probably wants to nap. Oh, she's going to hug loving lovingly. Good luck. Your mum's already left. <laughs> Your mum's gone. Oh, wait, she's late for work? What? Work? Now? Oh, I forgot.
the god I turned- I thought she was a teacher. I thought she was a teacher. When did she switch to being an influencer? I am so confused. I swear she was a teacher. Did she change jobs? Is there a milestone for that? <laughs> I'm confused. Um, right. Well, you've got your food. Where is the baby? You're making your way downstairs. <sighs> and she's going to go and play. She's having her own fun time. She's doing great. She was a teacher once upon a time. She was a teacher and she's changed her ways. Okay, Jules has had a singular fancy cuisine and is patting himself on the back. Mum's like, you're on your own, I need food. <laughs> she's she's gone to work. All right. Um, well, he's got his food. You didn't get your food, but that's fine. We might. Hang on, we might just go home. All right, Jules, you've had your snack. Let's go. Can you bring your toddler with you though? Like, don't just leave. Like, bring your child. Is he getting her? Is he going to get her first? <gasps> Father of the year, everybody. He's remembered his daughter. He remembered... I kind of want them to have another baby so we can have an infant. Just to like explore infants as well. But like this is very cute. I love the running with a toddler who's just like clinging on for dear life. That's all it takes to be father of the year. That's all it takes. Sophie only earned $50. Are you kidding me? That's embarrassing. Kim K would be embarrassed, honestly. Also, apparently Kim K might not be going to the Met Gala this year and it's she probably will, but the fact that there's a theory that she might not be going, I'm impressed. I'm excited. She does not need to be there at all. Um, okay, someone needs to feed this child. Um, can you do it? Actually, do we, she can probably get leftovers herself. She's a competent child. She's capable. Boom. Grab a serving. See, you're done. Easy peasy. I'm a potato. 29%. I'm a potato. 16. Oh my goodness. Not much potatoes today right now. I'm a potato. I'm a potato. Oh, oh, look at the 45% club though. I am impressed. But the potato shortage really has, has, it's officially reached the string, guys. We've, we've officially been affected. You can't say you haven't been affected by the potato shortage anymore. It's hitting me too. It's hitting all of us. Actually, pardon me. Um, oh, it's because we're all full of kachow. That's why. Oh my, we really are overflowing with kachow instead. You know what? That's okay. We can take that instead. <gasps> Picky eater. No. Are you serious? Oh God. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. Picky eater. Very particular about food. Well, did you eat it at least? Did she not eat it? She was like, no, thank you. Disgusting. She literally put it back. Well, I'm putting it back in the fridge. You can go to bed. Unbelievable. Um, we've been kachow potatoes. Oh, we need a new theory. <laughs> oh no. Wait, hang on. I don't know how kachow I am. Oh God. I take it back. I take it back. <laughs> I take it back. F's in chat for my lack of kachow, please. I really take that back. That's upsetting. That's a real lack. That's severe. That's so severe. Good Lord. Okay, Sophie didn't have a good time, but that's fine. Um, 
Oh, got that out just in time. Oh, we need to sell this. Uncomfortable from working out. When did you work out? I'm confused. I did not see it. Okay, you're going to the bathroom. I don't know why you're so desperate to go to the bathroom. Low bladder. You're telling me, mate. You're telling me. Okay. Uh, thank you for the last exception. That was you, obviously. I see. Waking up, do be a workout. It do be. Thank you for redeeming. Um, Lightning McQueen. Ka-chow. 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 I'm just going to set them up here so I can see. They're like extra goggles. Oh my goodness, she's getting all the quirks. Early riser. And now she's hungry. Well, you wouldn't have been hungry if you'd finished your meal before. Um, what are you cooking? Oh God, not a chef. Not a chef. Wear them properly. But then I can't see. I can see enough. You know, I can see enough. Um, no, you need to, you don't need to be read a book. You need to eat food. Can you eat that? Eat the hot dog. Steal it from your mum. She made it for you. Okay. Clean that spoiled fruit again. There we go. Yep. Okay. He's having a boogie. And then what does he need to do? Is he working today? He's working in three hours. Um, let's have him do some programming. Okay, is she gonna like this? Does she like this at all? I can't tell, does she like it? <laughs> I can't see. I think she's enjoying it, okay, good. Um, now, I'm just gonna check because I've been caught out before when we've tried to do the woohoo. Let's just quickly see MC woohoo actions. No, not that. Risky 50%. Perfect. All right, you two. Time to maybe make a baby. Oh, you know, let's, let's. No, we're going to woohoo. We're not, we're going to leave it up to chance. She's not feeling it, but that's fine. She'll be in the mood in a minute. It's okay. Actually, maybe she'll be more sore <laughs> if she's sore from working out. Um, how's that? Can I do that? I'm doing this. Oh, never mind. I just want to see what's happening. I want to see what's going on. ka -chow. Also, the, the light is just like blocking my little ka -chow face. I'll have to do that so you can see the details. Okay, you're all done. You're all done. Um, can you... How are her skills, actually? Communication could be higher. Let's go and talk to the, the oh, daddy. Ka-chow. Ka-chow. Hello, worm. Welcome in. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Yes, let's check my ka-chow level now, actually. Let's see if it's improved. <gasps> it's improved! Confirmed. The glasses fix everything. Perfect. Thank goodness. I was worried. Did they have some some woohoo? Did they? They sure did. <laughs> He's pleasantly uh, satisfied. <laughs> um, Love and the chat shades. Thank you. Thank you, Em. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing very, very well. She is falling apart. Um, we're going to do that. Then we're going to take a pregnancy test because I think she could be pregnant. <laughs> I've got a sneaking suspicion that she could be pregnant. I feel like usually when it gives you the pregnancy test option, it means your sim is pregnant. Like that's generally how it goes. But I could be wrong. Oh boy. Um, let's 
just replace it. That's fine. Oh, we actually don't have that much money. We probably should have tried to repair it herself. But we didn't have time to wait. We have an important test to take. Is she expecting? I don't know if she wants to be expecting or not. The lip quiver? Is she okay? I don't know if she wants to be pregnant and now I'm concerned. Whoop. Not pregnant, okay. Oh, and she's now she's sad about it. Oh gosh, well we also need to take care of this child. So we'll give this child a bath. Um, is he off to work? Yeah. He's feeling great. She is not pregnant. She is not. Ooh. Oh, new family dynamic. Ooh, okay. This is exciting. Comes to Sophie and Maple, a sense of order seems to be abound as the younger Sim has a deep respect for their older family member, meeting the high expectations. Okay. This is exciting. For family members with a strict family dynamic, the older Sim will ask the younger Sim to do things like cleaning more, and the younger Sim will generally avoid rebelling. They might get more stressed. Let's say yes. That's exciting. They could have a science baby. They could have a science baby. Ba baby? Baby. We might not do a science baby just yet. Um, but maybe if they, like, if they don't, if they fail to conceive, like, a second time, then we could try, like, the IVF fruit. Um, um, but yeah, it's an option on the phone now, Rahim. Um, so not an alien baby. They can have a it's here somewhere. Social? Um, is it under business? Have a science baby as a single parent, but she's not a single parent. She's not a single parent. That's confusing. Um, ooh, unknown caller. <gasps> ooh, ooh. We're getting everything. We're getting everything new. Things have been crazy lately. I need a place to stay for a while. Mind if I crash at your place for a bit? Anonymous. Is this an old friend? Is this an old lover? Who is this? Is it family? We're gonna say yes, because I want to explore this. Who is it? It's anonymous. So I'm assuming it's someone we don't know yet. Are they paying rent? Cause we don't, we need rent. We're not rolling in money. Are they gonna rock up with a suitcase? <gasps> This is so exciting. Oh my gosh, she's so sad. And she's stressing about being like uptight. Well, that's a lot. She doesn't want to be a strict parent. She wants to be a cool mom. She just wants to be a cool mom. I guess that means that like maybe Jules and Maple can have like a really fun, easy dynamic. He can be like the cool dad. Who's coming over? I am so intrigued. <laughs> There's no one with a suitcase. No one's got a suitcase. No one's at the front door. Okay, can, is there any cute dynamics she can have? A hug lovingly. Cause she does, and she also needs to eat. We really need to eat. Um. Okay, let's cook some food, serve a caprice, caprice, caprice salad. Where is the alien? Is it you? Is it you, Bess? If it's Bess, I swear to God. It's Bess? You wanna know who Bess is? This is literally his ex. Are you joking? Are you joking? His ex? His ex has come to stay? Are you kidding me? Is she trying to steal him back? Are you joking? Of all of the people? 
Are you kidding me? How long is she staying? I mean, we've welcomed, we have to welcome her in. Is she trying to steal him back? She's trying to steal Jules back. She's going to be a single mom. I, Maple needs to scare her off. Are you trying to be like an evil stepmom? Are you trying to like get rid of Sophie? What is this? Yeah, I'd be scared too. Can we discuss fears first? Actually get rid of that fear real quick. You can at least give us that. Is she bringing suitcases in? No. I'm shocked. Also, you need to go to bed. Okay, you're taking yourself to bed. Good. And do we have bills to pay? I don't know. That's kind of cute though. She can stay at my house. She can stay at your house, but not my house. I don't want her at my house. Okay, let's at least go inside. <gasps> Wait, this is broken? Oh no. That looked like it was broken, but it was just the plate. <laughs> Clean that. Please take her off my hands because this is upsetting. Where are you even going to stay? Where are you going to sleep? There's no extra bed. We don't have an extra bed. Oh my god, Nancy, what do you want? Daryl Charm and I had a blast together. I did not see that coming, but sure. Good for you, Nancy. You and your several children. Um. Oh, I thought these... Oh, hang on. Yeah. I was just going to say, I thought that they had changed the wheel, and they have. Oh my god. Small talk. Do we have any, like, do we have a profile with her at all? They're just, they're just friends. Oh, we can't see his preferences though, his profile with her. I'm going to get him to work hard so we can get promoted at least. Bess, what are you doing? What are you doing in my house? What are you doing in my bedroom? Uh-uh. Oh. Oh, she's cleaning. Okay, she can stay. Bess, <laughs> you can stay. Maybe she's like the cool ex-wife or ex-partner that's like just hanging out. That's okay. Um, hello, hello, Lizina. How are you? Welcome in. Oh, my gosh, this storm we do not need. We also need to fix up this house. I'm aware. I don't love this house at all. I think we're going to probably like scrap it completely and then rebuild. But we need a little bit more money first. Okay. Um, and we've nearly gotten over the failed conception. <laughs> and now we are just scared of rain. Great. Um, discuss fear of deaths. Can we do that? Where's that going to be? I don't understand the new wheels. Oh, discuss fears. No? Where's it gone? Oh, it was just there. And she's asleep. Okay, never mind. Um, Dilly, hello. Hello, fellow, fellow Melbourneian. Indeed, indeed. How are you? Welcome in. How are you coping with the weird heat today? So weird. Always a bit more money. We always need a bit more money, especially in The Sims when I'm trying to avoid cheats. And she just is incapable of doing anything without breaking a plate. Are you having a shower? You're having a bath. Bess, what are you doing in our house? Like, for real, what is the plan? So confused. Um, not good for her neck. It's not good for her neck. So weird. It was windy, then hot, then rained for a bit. Was, right? It's so weird today in Melbourne. They're like, it's 37 degrees, everyone. And I was like, it was sunny for two seconds. Then it was cloudy. Then it was like that. It's been weird. It has not felt 37 all day. Like, I was going to do washing, and then I was like, I can't because it might rain. And I'm confused. Okay, you're in a good mood now. Um, let's discuss fear of death. There we go. Um, talking about heat and we're freezing our butts off here. Do you want to take some heat? 37 Fahrenheit here. Oh my goodness. That's, is that, that's cold. That's cold. 
I don't know Fahrenheit at all. I'm so bad with like Fahrenheit temperatures. Oh my gosh, I have an eyelash in my eye. Ugh. As always. Um, just above zero. Oh, really cold. Jeez, that is cold. Yeah, no, it's it's been like basically hot here. It's weird weather. Uh, been high 30 to here too. Right, so bizarre. It's, I keep forgetting that it's like March, like mid-March now. Like in my mind, I'm like, yeah, it's still summer. And then I have to be like, actually, technically it's autumn. What is that, by the way? What is that? Can I put that in? Can we sell that? Why can't I sell it? Oh, I also need to ship that. Oops. Bess, you'll just have to chill here for a hot second. You're spooked at work. Great. That's not going to help you get promoted. You need, need to get promoted, mister. Oh, now you're scared too. Can everyone stop being scared? Do we have enough points to stop her from being scared? Um... Always welcome cold accumulation. Uh, oh, storm chase is like a thousand. Okay. Okay. What can we do? Can we listen to electronica? Don't run. Listen to. Done. Let's get that one done. Um, and here Fahrenheit is what thirty-seven degrees is. Oh my goodness. Right. So it's been basically 98 here for us and 37 for you. That is crazy. Oh. We're springing for us in two days. Still going to be cold. You know, it's so interesting. Like the fact that I didn't realize for a long time that seasons start on different days for the rest of the world. Like in Australia, like 1st of March is the beginning of autumn. Doesn't matter what the weather's doing. The 1st of March is when we're like, ah, it's officially autumn. Like, we go by months. We don't go by actual, like, weather. But not all places do that. Like, a lot of countries use, like, the summer solstice or the winter solstice or whatever to, like, mark the different, like, it's, like, the different seasons starting. They go by the weather, which makes sense. We do not. Um, oh, we could gain more handiness to help her be less clumsy. Interesting. Right, you guys are having a boogie. Love that for you. Who's this? Amelia? Mm, no. Shall we invite her in? Let's... Mm, actually, no, we're not going to. I don't like the look of it. March weather can't make up its own mind of what to do. It honestly can't make up its mind. Weather is just a suggestion. The weather is a suggestion. That's it. But yeah, the fact that it's like mid-March, it feels like summer. It also feels like spring. It's weird. I don't know what to wear every day. I wake up and I'm like, do I need the jacket? I don't know. And by weather in the UK, be winter 90% of the year. True, true, true. And if you went by the weather in Melbourne, the, the seasons would change by the minute. And that would confuse everyone even more. Right, you're having a little boogie. They're really getting down. Love that for them. Um, Dilly, thank you for the follow. Welcome into the cozy club. Welcome, welcome in. All right. Um, we are getting water. No, can we not get water? That is the go-to of all Sims. I don't need it. I want him to come home so I can look at his profile properly with Bess. What does this mean? What is this? They have... Okay. What are these? Compatibility. Wait a minute. Compatibility? Good compatibility. <gasps> Wait, but he doesn't have compatibility with her. <gasps> Wait a minute. Does she have compatibility with anyone? 
If she had it with Salim, I'd be so mad because we nearly dated Salim. No, okay. No compatibility for her. Cool. He's got compatibility. Maybe they were just good friends. I swear they had a relationship. But this is interesting. Based on their preferences, these have good compatibility. They might not be best friends instantly, but it won't be a challenge for them to get along. Well, no, that's not okay. And now she's like staying here. And I don't know where she's going to be sleeping tonight, to be honest. I don't know what her plan is. I am suspicious. Truly. Um, also, can you do anything for work? Do you have work? Work in four hours. Okay. Gauge in side hustles. Post a review? Okay. You need to... Oh, can we spread the word on side hustles? Let's do that. Our season date's based on the solstices and the equinox. So that makes sense. Honestly, like, that makes sense that it would do that. Like, you'd be working with the actual weather. But not us. Australia, we're just like, nah, it's the same dates, same days every year. Always was, always will be. Um, um, check side hustle followers. I don't know how to increase our skill. I guess we could do odd jobs. Korea. Find odd jobs. Let's do like an odd job. Even though she would, she really wouldn't. Like Sophie would never do, would never do that. Um, having more followers will net Sophie better gifts from friendly companies. Okay. What are all of these? Looking for gamer. Vlad, Vlad's looking for a gamer buddy. Um, no. Okay. Mm, we're not going to do those today. Maybe we'll just read about being an entrepreneur. Do we have the book? We do not. We're going to have to buy the book. Okay. Purchase skills entrepreneur. Why does it not exist? Gunning. Is there no books on being an entrepreneur? Am I saying that right? Entrepreneur. I'm um, using science to decide a science thing. Honestly, isn't that so crazy when people use science? Like, oh, it's, astron it's an astronomical system. It is astronomical. Truly. Um, good old Vlad. Good old Vlad the gamer dude. He's a gamer boy. Um, how are we going to reach level two? Maybe we can resume this and sell this. Is that maybe a side hustle? A freelance? I don't know how to do that. We can post a review of something, surely. Um, where, right? Um, web? Blog about feelings, research. How do we post a review? Why does it tell me? Sophie seems like she would do Yelp reviews. She would absolutely do Yelp reviews. She would leave like one star and be like, they didn't seat me right away. And that's like, you tried to walk in with, a, with a, like a booking of 30 with no booking. Like, what did you think was gonna happen? Um, Where can I write a review? Order. Let's blog about feelings at least on her like mummy blog, obviously. She's gonna have a mummy blog. And then we'll go from there. Um, research, it's not research. Where did she post this review? I'm so confused. Oh, and we finished that. Okay, great. What's happening? What's happening? Bess is freaking out. Well, you know what, Bess, you can freak out elsewhere. She'd never give good reviews. I think she would leave some good reviews because she's not like the worst. Oh my God, she's like literally being screamed at in her own home. Can we tell Bess to leave? 
Can we make an enemy actually out of her? Because she made, she was scary. So I'm going to argue. Um, what can we do? Mischief? Stop yelling at me. She's going to yell at us again, isn't she? Well, now she's just chatting. This is just crazy. Is reviewing part of her career? Reviewing is part of her career, I'm pretty sure, because it's a daily task. But none of these are able to be done. Um, let's... I think we're going to go to work. She can just go to work. Um, also, we need to feed this little precious one. Power of the day has to see how it's done. I thought I tried that. For some reason, it doesn't tell us. I think maybe because we haven't reached level two, maybe you need to have level two to do it. I don't know, but she is hopefully going to, oh no, so she can't get promoted if she doesn't have that. How is her entrepreneurial skill? Nearly. Okay. Um, if we just like sell a few more paintings, make a lifestyle review. <gasps> Can we do that? Is that going to count? Sophie, do a lifestyle review. Whatever that means. Whatever this means. Um, yeah, it's definitely not under career, which is weird because you'd think it would be. Maybe this is what's happening. Maybe she's doing it now. No, she's not. Maybe. She is increasing her entrepreneur skill. So something's happening. I don't think she's necessarily doing that, but... Something's happening. All right. Um, oh, and she's tired and she needs to go to work. Oh my God, she's gonna be late for work again. All right, now what's gonna happen with you two? What are you doing? You're dancing. Um, let's invite best dance. I'm being a little controversial here. I'm possibly starting some some drama, but that's okay. Um, we have one mac and cheese, maybe, for you. You can wake up and have some mac and cheese. These two are having a proper boogie. It's a little suspicious. Hey, when they hide the instructions you need deep within the pie menu, honestly, it's impossible to find. Like at some point, I'm like, I'm just never going to see it. I'm never going to know what I need. Also, we'll keep that beeswax, actually. What are you doing? You're picking her up and then putting her down right away? Great, great. Thank you for that. Thanks for that. That was great. She better like this mac and cheese, I swear. Can he, like, do something cute with her? Maybe when she's eaten. Um, also, you need a shower, sir. Take a brisk shower. But, like, Bess, where are you going to sleep? I don't understand where Bess plans on sleeping. Like, that doesn't make sense. Revamp the menu, so we'll have to relearn it all over again. I know, that's the that's like an annoying thing. Like, I understand why they changed the menu, but it's going to take me so long to get my head around it all. And, like, it's not everything. <gasps> Wait, discuss conquests? I mean, that's your wife that you only, like, you'll be talking about your wife, I assume, but let's do it anyway. She's like, dude, I'm not going to talk about your conquest. Like, this is your house with your wife. This is embarrassing. Yeah, he should be embarrassed. <gasps> he wants to flirt. He wants to flirt with her. Are you kidding me? His child is right there. I didn't even like cue that. I didn't do anything. I'm gonna let it unfold. He's also like technically feeling embarrassed. Also, his child is right there. You know what? You need to leave, honey. You need to leave. You better like run off and play with some toys. This is embarrassing. Oh, she, I don't think she was really vibing with it. 
And Sophie's back. Oh my god. I'm just like kind of seeing what happened. Oh, okay. <gasps> so sus. So suspicious. She's just like, what? What's going on? What did I miss? Okay, I'm going to bed now. Um, she has no idea what she just nearly walked into. Oh, we need to potty train. We need to potty train, I believe. He likes fitness, sure. Okay, quit your playing and go to the potty. I'm so suspicious of, of Bess right now. Like, what are you actually doing here? And also, how long is she staying? She didn't even, like, bring a suitcase. This is the thing. is like, in the expansion, like, in the EP, the EP was like, look, they walk in with a suitcase and they're like, hello. Where was that? Where was that interaction? Why can't I do that? Why can't I have Bess like barge in with a suitcase and cause drama? Oh my God, is she gonna yell at someone again? No. She's just running around for fun. Being, why aren't you being potty trained? Excuse me, potty trained. Um, love the new menu, but also hate it when I'm getting used to it. Yeah, it's just like taking me a while to get used to it. Someone with a suitcase and they stayed for a week. Well, Bess didn't bring a suitcase. She didn't do anything. She just rocked up at the front door. I don't know about that. Oh no. She's gonna have an accident out of fear. I don't blame her. Um, Sims to show up and won't leave. We're gonna have to maybe tell her to leave because she's just running around like this and then using our computer. No, we're gonna have to lock this. When she gets off it, we're gonna lock it. Bess didn't even have an umbrella. No, Bess did have an umbrella, but she didn't cover the umbrella. She didn't hold the umbrella over um, Sophie, which was I thought was very rude. I thought that was a bit uncalled for. I um, wonder if resetting Bess when I could go home. I don't know. Is there a way to make her leave? Ask to join a household. I will not. Thought Sophie was with the umbrella. No, I think um, I remember Bess held the umbrella. I don't. I didn't see Sophie holding it, as far as I know. How long are you here for, Bess? When will you leave? Just good friends. Uh huh. Uh huh. Where is she gone now? Let's go and talk to her and suss out like what's going on. Um, let's like joke about politicians. That's a nice safe bet. And you are going to talk to your little buddy over here. How long does she have to be a toddler? One day. <gasps> her birthday's tomorrow. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, she needs to increase her skills actually. Her thinking skills need to go up. Does she have a little iPad baby? No, she's not an iPad baby. Okay. Um, most Sims will have a send home option, but I don't see it on her. Hmm, interesting. She's like, she's not even letting me have the option to leave. It's just give her keys. Are you kidding me? No, she's not a new roommate. You can't do that. Go away. <laughs> Um, didn't think joking about politicians was allowed on Twitch. <laughs> Fair. <gasps> Flirtation, physical intimacy. Oh my goodness. I just kind of want to see what happens if they're just chatting. Um, give pep talk. We'll just see what happens. Oh, he's on the computer now. Um, okay, now how, what's happening? Goof around, okay, they're goofing. Jules, why are you gonna be like this? Jules and Bess, the two of you, why do you gotta be like this? <gasps> she just floated with him. Hey now. 
Oh. This is interesting. Are they still just friends? Mmm, just good friends. But she's also like cleaning up the house, which is like, mmm, okay. Like I'm not encouraging it, I'm just kind of seeing it play out, which is fascinating. Because we're just going to be like, hey, how was your day? Are you enjoying your time here? Are you enjoying like staying here? Oh my god, that trash is overflowing. Bess, take our trash out, please. Never mind, ignore the trash. You are getting all your little things up. How are your milestones going? Um, she needs to master her blocks. Deep conversation. Okay, they can have a deep conversation in the bathroom. This is an appropriate place to have a deep conversation. All deep conversations happen in bathrooms. We all know this. Okay, they just have like a nice chat. Yeah, a nice little bro-y hug. That's good. I approve. I approve. Oh. Oh. Interesting. Okay, they're just chatting. They're, now they're just chatting. That's okay. And he's going to go to bed. Great. Thank God. Guess I've never had a deep conversation then. You've never had like a big DM in a bathroom at a party? That's where all my deep conversations happen. At at parties, a few too many, a few too many drinks in the bathroom. That's when all the goss comes out, always. Mark Leonard was an actor on Played Box father on Star Trek, got to meet him at a convention. He liked to tell political jokes, but he would tell one Republican joke and then one Democratic joke. And they were always funny no matter what side you were on. That's good. That's smart. Mark Leonard do be smart indeed. Yeah, you've got to do like one for each. I think I go to parties. I mean, I didn't go to like that many parties, but I like went to like friends parties. Like my friends would be like having their sweet 16th or their 18th or the 21st. The big milestone birthdays. Why are you crying? Are you waking up? Oh, you're bored. You're bored. Okay, great. Well, guess what? Your husband's been flirting with another woman in your house. What do you say about that, Sophie? What do you say about that? Oh, she just wants someone to read to her. Maple's like, no one's reading to me. Everyone's being weird in this house. No one's just going to sit and read me a book. God damn it. You tell her, Mabel. Oh, Sophie's doing a great job. I hope Jules wakes up to this. This is so cute. Oh, it's done. She's like, that was boring. Okay, well, why don't you go and dance then? If you're so bored, go and dance. Let's put some vibes on. Oh, and you're hungry. And the trash needs to go out. Okay. Oh, we need an outdoor trash can. We do not have one of those. Whoops. I didn't know we needed an outdoor trash can. I've never done that. Have I? I don't recall ever having a trash can outside. Trash cans. What do we need? Like a garbage truck? Or just like one of these? Are these fine or is this fine? This is fine. What? Can't intersect with foundations. Are you kidding me? Let's just put one like... Hang on. And you got to have like two. Ooh. Lovely. Perfection. Um, you still tell stories about him trolling in the linear more. such a down-to-earth guy. That sounds so nice. I love that. I actually haven't watched a lot of Star Trek, but I've, um, when I used to do my TV captioning, I was checking a lot of captions. Like I did editing for TV captions. I was like the final check person. And I did have to check a lot of, um, like a lot of Star Trek. There was like different Star Trek. And then I would do, I checked a lot of Star Trek show, like episodes, Star Trek, Next Generation, 
And then there was a different show that I thought was Star Trek but was not. It was like very much not. Bess, do you want to do the trash? Oh, why are you angry? <gasps> oh! Oh! Excuse me! She's going to kick her again? Are you kidding me? Oh, you're hungry. Well, okay. Okay. Eat that. And she's not going to eat it because she won't want it. <laughs> Maple is going off. She's not going to take it because she doesn't want it. She's going to throw a tantrum. Is that spoiled too? That's probably gone off. Oh, she did eat it. Okay, she will eat it. Good. And then we'll put this... Okay, can we put the rest away? Also, we need to... Did we, did we sell this? We still haven't shipped this off. We need to ship this to Nina. Whoever wants it. Nina Caliente wants it. Um, okay, I only need one trash can, but we like to have both. I like to be organized. Most passengers around here only use one trash can for local pickup. That's so interesting. We always have two at least, like a minimum of two. Um, some places have three bins. Some places have four bins where I live now. Are you cleaning up? Thank you, Bess. The least you could do when you're trying to be a home wrecker. Um, what happened to her rebelling? Honestly, honestly, this little nugget is being quite rebellious, if you ask me. She didn't finish that. That's fine. She needs to go to bed. Okay. And we've got bad coffee next to us as well. Great. Um, you have three. So, when do you have recycling, green waste, and then rubbish? we I used to have two three and now I only have two um <laughs> so many jinxes happening tonight um we used to have what's going on oh, I thought it was like a broken sink it's just best we used to have or usually most places in Melbourne at least would have like normal rubbish and then you have the green waste which is like gardening like grass clippings and when you're doing your gardening anything gardening related goes in there and then you have I'm always confused about that one because it's like also maybe some food waste but not all food waste compost I guess and then you have recycling yeah so general waste green waste recycling some places now also have a um a glass rubbish bin for anything glass um but also at the same time a lot of stuff doesn't get recycled apparently in Australia slash in Melbourne like people say that recycling isn't really doesn't actually really happen at the other end where are you going are you going to work oh you're dancing okay sure can she post a review yet can she post a review and we also need to lock out hang on lock lock for everyone but the household and is there a career? There's not. We still can't post a review. Can we like post a review? It said lifestyle review. Let's try that again. Um, we have recycling food waste and cream waste. We get fine if we don't recycle. See, we're pretty good. We try and always recycle everything. I always like, we definitely make sure we divide up our recycling. So it's like you do have to recycle, but then people say that the recycling doesn't always happen at the other end. Like, I don't know. I try and recycle though, because I think it's good to do what you can. You know, it's, I'd rather do that than not, but yeah, it's definitely like fair. It's pretty much mandatory. I don't know how, how well it's monitored, but it does happen. Um, we only have the two... What's this? What are all these? Excuse me? I'll grab that and I'll grab whatever that is. Can I sell these? I can sell that. Thank you very much. I can't sell that. Fine, that's fine. I didn't want to sell it anyway. 
Why can't I sell it though? Like, why can't I? <laughs> Rude. Okay. Um, if you want to recycle, we have to take things to the local recycling center or local drop boxes for things like paper and cardboard. So you don't have like an actual recycling bin outside. That's so interesting. Yeah, you've only got the one. I've always had two bins minimum and then it extended to three. Now it's four. But my place only has three or two. We don't have the green waste bin anymore. It's... It's very strange. Is this review counting? I'm so confused. Oh, it's almost Maple's birthday. Okay, we have to have a birthday party for Maple's birthday. Um, we're gonna throw, oh, hang on, uh, an event. Birthday party. Maple is the birthday queen. Then we are, you know what's annoying is we haven't met the rest of the kids, so I can't invite like all of the goths and like land grabs kids. Um, we're gonna have to maybe visit their houses so we can see them, hang on. Okay, we're gonna have to go and visit them. We're gonna visit Bella and meet all of the goth kids and then meet all the land grab kids and then meet all the Bjergsons. Everyone better be home. Mortimer, Bella, Cassandra, Alexander, Carlo, Eddie, Ernest, and Austin. So many names. Um, we'll just visit just with ourselves. Oh, no, we'll go with Maple so Maple can meet the other kids. Because she should meet the others, I think. Oh, uh, no, we'll leave her be. We'll just meet them. We'll just meet them ourselves first. Um... I have a large city. They do it to big cities in the US. Population in New York City is larger than our entire state population. That's so huge. Oh my God. That's crazy. Are the kids goths? We'll find out how many of these kids are goths. Oh, there's one goth kid. Let's meet all of the children so we can invite them. Oh, sorry. Hang on. We're not in our correct outfit. They're not going to recognize her. Hang on. We need to be changed. There we go. Okay, that's better. Um, how's your day going? Hang on, we need to meet. Oh, never mind. We we're going to meet Mortimer, but we can't. Okay, let me meet the rest of the kids. Let's go and meet Eddie. Because Eddie, any of the boys could be a potential, you know, match for Maple. She's got a, you know... She's, she's got to marry into the Real Housewife clan, obviously. Okay, we'll meet Eddie. We've met Ern Ernest? Yeah, Ernest. I'm inviting myself in. Let me in. Can I invite myself in? Um, you have a crush on Holly Alto. Go for it. Why aren't we meeting the other kids? Let me in. Let me meet Carlo and Austin. I want to meet all the little kids. Recycling makes sense there, but not in rural areas like ours. That's so interesting. Cause I feel like recycling should just be done like regardless of where you live. But I guess maybe it's like extra work maybe. I know we just have, re I think we have recycling everywhere in Australia. As far as I know, I, I don't know about the regional areas, but I'm pretty sure recycling is Australia wide. I don't think we have it just in suburbs, but I don't know actually. Maybe we don't have it in all areas. I really don't know. Can we not go inside? Can someone please invite me in? Let me in. I'm trying to meet the family. Okay, we've met you. Have we met you? We like can't get through the gates. This is so rude. Bella's our bestie. Um, really don't have tax base to support the infrastructure. Oh, I see. That does make sense. I see. I see. Wow, it's just so fascinating how different that is. That's so interesting. Live in a tiny town. Recycling is everywhere. Recycling really is everywhere here. Um, let's boast about family. We're like, listen, kids. When you meet Maple, you're gonna be blown away okay all right you two were just in your own world let's meet you 
Can we meet the little one? Let's find out. He's making his way very slowly. Why can't we go here? I don't understand why we can't get past the gate. Why is the gate locked? Let me in. Let me in. Why are we locked out of the property? It's actually can't go any further. Oh, she can. She can go in. Well, then why are you acting like you can't? Is Bella even home? All right, let's go and meet the little one. And then we'll look for Bella. Because I swear she was meant to be home. But maybe not. Um, with the national mandates for something like that, only state laws and state legislature would have to do that. So it's statewide. Whereas I think ours is probably, like, I would assume it would be a federal thing. Okay, so we've met this child now. Good. Is Bella home? I don't actually know. Um, maybe she's not. Oh, who's that? There's a child. Eddie. Have we met Eddie? We have. No, we haven't met Eddie yet. We're going to go and meet Eddie. Um, Gigi, hello. Welcome in. It's orange dress for summer. Not that it is summer. It is actually middle of March, but, um, oh, there is Bella. Bella was hiding the whole time. I'm so confused. Where did she come from? Was Bella there the whole time? News to me. Um, wait, Maple? Maple, where did you come from? Did I bring her here accidentally? You know what? That's fine. You, you can talk to stranger. You can make a friend. Um, but um, also, Gigi, don't worry. Everyone has been low on potato today. We are all feeling low. Oh, okay. Except for Rahim. Never mind. I take it back. I take it back. Some of us have been having low potatoes. Some of us have been eating all the potatoes. There you go. You were just processing all your potatoes, Rahim. I see, I see. Um, let me go and start shower, truly. Um, also, welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Have legal limits on the federal government that prevents them from doing many things that remain a state prerogative. That's so interesting. We have a decent mix, I think. What is happening over there? Are the children fighting? Maple, don't make a mess. Don't make a mess. You are in someone's home. You need to say nonsense to this little kiddo. And then talk to Austin again. Let's say nonsense to Austin. Um, not too big of a job. I see, I see. Sharon fight. Oh, no, it's come from the bathroom. Yep, got to have all your starch. Have I improved my potato? Wait. Oh, Maple has leveled up. Good for her. I'm a potato. 76. I'm thriving, everybody. I'm thriving. I have grown. I have grown. I have improved. <sighs> Thank God. I was worried. All right. Have we met all the children? We've met all the children now, I think, except for the others. Um, we talked to Bella as well. Let's gossip with Bella. Our bestie. You're making a friend. Yay. You can... What else can we do? Tell a goofy story. It won't make any sense, but that's okay. Um, oh, no, you washed away too much starch. Too much, too much. GG, it's okay. You just need to give yourself extra potato love. That's all. That's all you have to do. That's okay. Um, oh, you're angry. Okay. Um, well, do you want to go on? Maybe we'll head off. We've met the children. Have we met all the children? Yes. We can't select that child. He doesn't seem to exist. Oh, there we go. Okay, we've met you. Whoops. So we've met all the kids. Except we haven't actually officially met the, um, these two, but that's fine. Um, we can head home now. Um, have a coffee now. Oh, you got your coffee? Good. I have to sneak through the house in the dark like a ninja. Don't make my wife. Oh my goodness. Good job. Good job. I'm impressed. I was nearly going to make another coffee, but it would be like 
I don't think I needed another coffee today. If I had a coffee before stream, it would be like at 7.30 at night. And I think that's probably not ideal, maybe. Just, just a hunch, probably not ideal. Um, not even 7 a.m. here. Oh my goodness, you're up early. Oh my goodness. Maple needs to check her attitude. Maple is living her best chaotic life. She's, oh God, do not fall when you're holding a child. She's living her best life right now, though. She's feeling herself. She's like, I'm a hot mum. I am mother. She's right. Can't have a coffee at 4 a.m. I mean, you could if you wanted to. I'm working today. I left the lights off, trying to be quiet so I don't wake her up. Well, that's really nice. That's good. Okay, this child needs to eat, but also needs to go to sleep. Let's put her to bed first. And let's do some cooking for everyone. Serve a garden salad. I'm sorry, but we don't have a lot of money right now. Is Bess still here? <gasps> Has Bess gone? Bess? We got rid of Bess. Oh, thank God. I was worried. I thought she was never gonna leave, but she left all by herself. Thank goodness. I was getting real, really, really worried. I thought we were going to have like a home wrecking situation. I was kind of excited for the drama, but I was kind of nervous. That's good. That worked out quite well for us. Um, you still haven't been promoted, dude. You need to work harder. I made myself asleep until about 6 a.m. Sleeping in for you is till 6. I can't function when I'm awake at 6. I can't do it. Craving drama? Listen, you want drama? When did she go to work? She works in two days. Okay. There will be drama, I believe, at the birthday party. Let's see. At event. Birthday party. Let's get this organized now. Um, guests. Boom, boom. Bella. Nancy. Bess. Um, oh, we haven't met all of um, the Bjergsons and the land grab kids. Hang on, we need to go meet the land grab kids. Okay, you can have a bite to eat and then we're going to have to go and meet them. And then meet the Bjergsons just so we can invite like all of the families and have like a big real housewives, like Sims housewives birthday party. With drama. There will be there will be drama. I am anticipating it. Oxy moron, honestly. You should get up at 5.15 when I'm working. Oh, that's so early. I could not do it. Um, that's if my body to the point that gives me a headache. You know what? That's fair though. Honestly, Hillbilly, that makes sense. Like when I am really overtired, I get a headache. And if I'm like yeah, I, I guess like when you throw your body off the rhythm enough, it definitely, I can see how it would like give you a headache and like really mess you up. Okay, they were still being cute. Okay. All right, can we just have like a little quick power nap? A little disco nap. Have a quick disco nap. Finish your food. You need to practice your programming. Thank you. Um... Like getting on the same time each day. See, I'm like all over the place, truly. But I tend to wake up around 8 because I work afternoon, so I don't start work till like 12. So if I wake up at 8, I still have time in the morning before I have to leave. Except I'm always like, oh, I'm going to get all this stuff done. Like I'm going to be really productive. In my mind, I'm like, I'm going to, you know, get all this editing done. I'm going to be, you know, getting my TikTok schedule sorted. I'm going to be on top of everything. I don't. I sit on the couch and like stare into space for like half an hour. Um, but in my mind, I'm like, eventually I'll get, you know, comfortable at work and I'll be able to be more creative in the mornings. But, oh, are you joking? That's a suitcase. That is a suitcase. Excuse me. All right, you know what? Deep conversation. 
Gigi wanted drama and I'm here to provide. Um, Bess, are you joking? All right, let's see what happens. All right, bro handshake, good. That's not romantic, that's okay. Sophie's literally napping in the other room. Um, gonna be reproductive, I'm unproductive. Indeed, getting coffee at the same time, that's smart too. Goofing around, that's okay. You guys can goof, I'll allow goofing. Oh my god, no. Um, I'm just like seeing what they're up to. <gasps> you just confessed his attraction? Dude! Dude! No, you need to finish what you started or, I don't know, make a decision. Yeah, the two of you can just stand there. Okay, you're going to clean up. Okay. Jules, this is so chaotic. Um, army res reservist, reservist? Reservist for a very long time and grew up on a dairy farm. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, so you are definitely used to an I'm early morning. Title. That makes sense. Um... I suck it away when I could do lots of things I want to do. The thing is, Hillbilly, the thing is I want to sleep. <laughs> so for me, I'm like, that's the thing that I do want to do. So I will sleep if I can. But I also know, like, I don't want to waste my whole day. Like, there is things I want to do. That's why I don't – I like sleeping in, but also sometimes I'm like, mm, I could have actually been, like, reading. I could have been doing all kinds of things. Bess, what are you doing? This tension is too much, please. Let's, um, oh, she's awake. She's awake. Okay. Okay. I should probably stay out of it. Um, Cat Phil, Cat Pill, Cat Pill, thank you for the follow. Welcome into the Cozy Club. Welcome, welcome in. I hope you're doing well. Oh my gosh. She has no idea the drama she just missed. All right. I'm going to leave them here and we're going to go and meet the land grab kids. Um, happy to be here. Happy to have you here, Capil. Have you played much of the new pack yet? Do you have the new pack? Are you invested in the drama? The drama is exhausting me, to be honest. Also, where do the land grabs live? I literally don't know where they... I know it's a big house. Are they Oasis Springs? I found it. How many kids have they got? Let's go and meet them. They've got Marjorie and Jonathan. Oh my lord. Have you ever heard of more land grab names? Jonathan and Marjorie. That's so on brand. And then what's the dog's name? Fearly. Okay, I can get behind that. Um that's nuts. Um, early mornings are better because it's peaceful and quiet. Nobody's going to be calling you and bothering you at the same time at that time of day. So here, Billy, I do that, but in the evening. Like, that's how I feel. I feel at peace. I'm a night owl. Obviously, I stream at night. I feel like I... Oh, it's me, a toddler right now. I'm mo most at peace at, like, 11.30 at night. That's when I'm like, ah, this is, this is the, this is the time. Okay, you've met you've met Marjorie. Um, can we like knock on the front door? Where is the front door? Can we go in? Knock on door. Hello, let me in. I need to meet everyone so we can leave and go back to watching Bess and Jules's car crash situation. Couldn't be any more land grab. There could not be any more land grab. Um, night owl on my jobs at night. See, Gigi, that's smart. Do you feel more productive then? I like I like working in the afternoon because then I feel like I can sleep in a bit, and then so I sleep. Well, I sleep until like eight or nine or whatever. Get up, like do my thing, go to work, and then I come home at night and I'm like, I can chat. I can like debrief. I can relax. I can do whatever I need to do. Ew, no thank you, land grabs. Keep it in your pants. I know it's your house, but, like, get a room. Said what I said. Where are your children? There's one. 
There's Jonathan. Um, also, you haven't had a chance to get it yet, unfortunately, Kappa. That is all good. The pack like, only came out a few days ago, and it's also kind of pricey. So I don't blame you for, like, holding off. I do not blame you. Um, I'm kind of annoyed that I, like, I had got the update for The Sims. Like, I did the big infant update and then got the pack without playing much of the update. So I don't know what's just pack and what's just update. Okay, now we have met the child. It was just the two of them we needed to meet. We, we don't really need to meet Malcolm, to be honest. I don't want to meet Malcolm. I want to go and meet the Bjergsen children. Usually wait until the CD um, sale or CD keys. That's smart. That's I think that's a good way to do it. Okay, now we're looking for... No, no one lives here. The Bjergsons, I believe, live here. Villareal. Do they? The Bjergsons. Do they have any children? They have so many children. <laughs> okay, we've got Bjorn, Clara, Sophia, Elsa, Samara, Brian, Kyra. These names all suit. Shout out to, like, the the game for generating appropriate names for this family and Furball perfect perfection I love it um growing up we had to catch the school bus at 7 30 a.m prior to going to school we had milk 40 cows clean the barn feed calves feed horses feed chickens collect eggs get ready for school all before the bus got here that's wild that is exhausting I could I could not be me all right, meeting another child. Let me just meet all the children as quick as I can. Let's knock on the door. Because once we've met all the children, we can invite them all to the party along with, like, the parents. Because I want to invite everyone. I don't know where we're going to have the party. I feel like it needs to be somewhere fancy. Can we have it at a venue maybe? Maybe, like, at the recreation venue or something. That could be kind of cool. Um, but Hillbilly, that sounds like such a hectic, hectic start to a morning. Like, I wake up and just, like, stare into, like, the abyss for a while. That's all I can do in the morning. I could not, like, look after, I mean, I look after my cat, but, like, she has an automatic feeder, so I don't have to feed her in the morning. I just, like, I have to check that it's gone off and check that she has water. But, like, that's it. I don't have to do anything else. I couldn't feed like 40, 40 cows. All right, let's actually meet Bjorn because we haven't met Bjorn yet properly. This is a big house and it's kind of ugly. I'm just going to throw that out there. It's kind of an ugly house. Also, I don't think there's enough beds. One, two. Oh, there is not enough beds in this house. That's fine. Um, who else we need to meet? Clara. Where are the other children? There's one. Brian. Let's meet him. Um, I just take care of a mini demon version of myself I created. That's a lot of work too. Mini demon versions of yourself sound quite chaotic. Just like this cat. Um, and by my body left me voluntarily wake up at 7 a.m my gosh no thank you why are you tense from milestone reflection wait she's stressed about a milestone it's like she hasn't accomplished enough that's fine you're okay all right let's let's leave let's go home and then we can get the party organized for tomorrow um Get up at 4.30 a.m. to get started. That's so early. Three hours to get all done. It was part of the routine. I mean, I guess if you're in a routine, you'd be like kind of, you get used to the routine, but I could never. All right, she's strutting off. I say strutting. She does need to use the bathroom, but that's still kind of strutting. Running in heels? 
a queen. A queen right here, everybody. Um, grew up in a dairy farm on the weekends of my childhood and loved it. Also had an uncle with cattle. Oh, wow. So many dairy farmers here in chat right now. Wild. And just to insert myself into this narrative, my name means farm girl. So just saying. Like, I could be a farmer if I wanted to because my name literally means farm girl. How exciting for me. Some people's names mean like heavenly or like brave. My name means farm girl. I just want to fit in. I just want to be included in my chat. Who are you having negative interactions with? Who are you feeling negative about? And this is a long run, might I add. Where are you running to? Do not trip in heels, my God. Running in like the mud. Absolute bananas. Um, also, yes, I do have a Discord. There is a Discord link there. Thank you, Lily Mae. Um, I want to change this song. I did it. I have too many things on my stream deck at this point. This is exhausting. All right, run to the bathroom. Any bathroom, any bathroom that I can access. That one there. Do you want to maybe like clean your child? Cause she's like stinky. Thank you. Um, deactivate social bunny. Oh, I forgot about social bunny. We can't deactivate social bunny because she needs it. Only 16 followers. This is embarrassing. She's meant to be an influencer. Um, we better make a new post. Happy narrative post about travel. Okay. Um, messages. Let's be happy. Hey, bestie. Okay. Style is everything. Teach me your ways. Thank you. Let's react to that. Friends. Can we add to our contact list? Let's add best so we can like roast her. Um, Followers on Social Bunny is bugged. Oh, that's annoying. That reminds me, actually. I need to add. There is a mod. I don't know if it's been updated yet for the new pack. But there is a mod. Someone did, like, basically a Social Bunny overhaul and added, like, a heap of new messages and interactions based on all different life stages. And I really, really want to use it. I think it's what we need. It's what we deserve. Um. Okay. react Sophie listen to those old folks telling us they couldn't get out of the pool with a ladder hit the gym that sounds interesting okay um so our experience on farms I was born and raised in the bush I was born and raised in the suburbs so don't worry <laughs> um but also speaking of discord um i need to I'm gonna pause real quick and quickly do a save because i haven't saved in like an hour um two hours um real quick um the discord powerpoint party that we unlocked in the subathon the other week um will be happening at the end of the month um it will be on Friday the 31st, so I won't be streaming on the Friday, but I'll be doing a Discord PowerPoint party on the Friday uh, where basically you can all submit a little PowerPoint and um, we're going to go through them all together. And so if you, I think we're going to do it so you send them to me and then I'll share the screen and we can all like look at all of the PowerPoints everyone makes. Um, and it can be about whatever you like. You can use PowerPoint. You can use like the Google PowerPoint, any website that does a PowerPoint. You can make a PowerPoint on that about whatever you like. Make sure it is like, you know, not super inappropriate, please. Um, but it can be about any topic that you like that you just want to like make a little fun PowerPoint on. Um, and... It's going to be super, super cute. I'm going to post all the details in the Discord either tonight or tomorrow when I've got everything written up. Um, but I'm really excited. Um, and I'm really, yeah, I think it's going to be a really fun time. It's going to be nice and chill. Don't feel too stressed about it. You don't have to, like, present it. You just have to put together a little fun, cute PowerPoint. 
it can be about The Sims, it can be about like a game, any game. It doesn't even have to be game related. You can make it about like your pet. You can make it about like your favorite TV character. Anything you like really. Excuse me, I told you to give your child a bath. What are you doing? Give Mabel a bath. And she can go to bed. Oh, and we need to get the, the party planned now. Properly planned. Okay. Um, birthday party. Okay. Um, that's so weird though. Um, have to wake up again. Oh no, I'm sorry. Oh, that's a bummer. You can still submit a PowerPoint if you want to, if you want to, um, get involved. Um, cause I'll try and like, once we've done the PowerPoint party, I will like post like I'll try and post them all somewhere so we can all still look back at them afterwards. Also, I'm about to sneeze. I sneezed. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm gonna turn my, oh, I was gonna turn my fan off, but then I think I'll, I think that would make me sneeze more. It's too hot to turn off the um, fan, to be honest. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much Jinx in chat tonight. Thank you everybody. I'm okay. Um, I always mute myself because I'm like, I don't know how loud my sneeze would be. <laughs> um, but anyway, and a roof back to you. True, 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 true. Um, but thank you for all the blessings. I appreciate it. <laughs> Alternate weekends at work that weekend rotation has been working on oh, bummer. Um, that is annoying, but yes, everyone is welcome to join, um, join in on the PowerPoint. It's just going to be Friday, like probably Friday evening. Yeah. It'll have to be Friday evening. Cause like for me, cause I am working on the Friday. Um, but it'll be probably like 8 PM. Yeah. We'll do 8 PM. It'll we'll kind of kick things off. Um, but I'll post more details in, in the discord as well. Um, and then once the Discord PowerPoint party is over. I'll make sure that I, I like pop up everyone's PowerPoint so you can like go back and look at them. Or if you've like missed them, you can go back and look at them and it'll be a good fun time. And I also need to plan my Fortnite stream. I need to work out when I'm playing Fortnite. That's going to come up very, very soon as well. We need to do a Fortnite stream. I have not forgotten. I'm terrified. Um, oh, I'm not inviting Morgan. Sorry. Inviting all the children. Yawn, Sophie, that's a lot of people. That's good. Okay. Um, caterer, we do need a caterer. We'll invite Kimberly. Actually, let's just hire it. We'll hire it out. Um, entertainer? No. Mixologist? No. And where are we going to have it? I kind of want to have it at... Um, not the bar. Can we have it at the, the celebration place? Community space, center park. Can we have it here? I don't know if this is like somewhere that you can have a party, but I think we should do this. Otherwise we have like the community centers. Not those ones. Uh, it just it needs to be like a cute little place for a but I think we're gonna have the birthday party here. We'll have it here. We'll have it at like five, six o'clock. We'll do six o'clock tomorrow. Okay. Done. Ooh, I'm excited. It's gonna be dramatic. They will be flirting on your behalf. Probably. I can't seem to control him. Okay. How are her milestones going, by the way? She's, oh, she's an early riser as well. My goodness. She's got all the quirks. I'm overwhelmed, honestly. Okay, Bess, at least you're cleaning. You know, you've got that for me, but that's kind of all you've got going on. Here, movement in the house. <gasps> movement in the house. I was like, Bess? <laughs> All right, you also need to like go to the bathroom, dude. Go to the bathroom. And then, 
Only then. Pillow fight with Bess? No! No! No pillow fighting with someone that's not your wife. Unbelievable. It's okay, she's cleaning up the mess. She's fine. Cat may have woken to my wife or her bladder. <laughs> Probably the cat. Why are you still dirty? Can you ask her for a bath? Actually, no. You know what? We're going to wake you up. You're going to give you, your child a bath. A bubble bath. She can have a bubble bath. Can we please? Or maybe a bubble bath over here. Because apparently Jules is shocking at giving his own child a bath. So if it wasn't me, you're off the hook. You're off the hook. <laughs> Thank goodness. You can say you didn't do it. Okay. Bathing this small stinky child. I just want to have, have an infant. I want to have an infant and like experience the infants of this update. <laughs> But we've had no time to woo. -hoo. You know what? Maybe we can do it like once she's had the bath. Once she's bathed. I mean, Bess is just chilling. We can do it when Bess, Bess is here. I don't care. If Bess doesn't like it, like not my problem. You don't have to listen. All right, she's having a good time. We'll let him get a bit more sleep and then, ooh, bath before woo <laughs> sounds like a good plan. I think so. We'll, um, we'll pop her once she's bathed. She can go and do her thinking skills. And uh, we can do a little a little woohoo. I think we'll do a woohoo not try for baby because I'm trying to leave it to chance. And we'll see how that goes. Everyone wants to pillow fight with Beth. What the heck? I guess because she's the only person awake. She's the only one that's awake. I understand. Okay, we're having a fun time. We're bonding. This is good. Bess is grooving. She's having a great time. She's like being a little borderline homewrecker. Just having a boogie. She's good. She might not be happy when she hears them like woohooing in the next room, but like that's fine. That's not my problem. Oh, you can go potty. Okay, you can go potty over here. Um, I'm gonna have to head off my, my mini demon has a play date with more mini demons in the morning and I need to rest before it. That is all good. Um, enjoy the play date with all the mini demons. <laughs> I hope it's not too chaotic. Um, but thank you so much for popping into the stream and hopefully we'll catch you again soon. Um, and thank you for joining the Discord as well. Um, take care. Oh, we broke that. We'll have to replace that, I guess. That's fine. All right, I'm waking him up so we can do a little cheeky woohoo. Don't go to sleep. I'm waiting for him to wake up. Don't eat either. You're uncomfortable? Too bad. What if he says no? What if he's like, I'm not in the mood? Oh, he's in the mood. Perfect. Does she care? Oh my God, Bess! Bess! Oh! <gasps> Oh no! Caught cheating? No, you weren't! No, you weren't. Bess, you walked into that yourself. Bess, you did that all on your own. Is she gonna yell at him? <gasps> Bess, you walked into that yourself. Oh my goodness. Is she gonna leave? I mean, they're still friends. Can he apologize? <laughs> what do we even do with that? Does she have any profiles? 
Sentiments? We have no sentiments with her. Well, then it's fine. She doesn't seem that affected. She's just like, she's like, oh, I need to go to the bathroom as well. I better go and do that. Okay, well, you can have some food as well. You didn't even cheat. That's your wife. This has been a very aggressive stream. It has been. It's been more aggressive than I was expecting, to be honest. I wasn't expecting, like, a cheating scandal. So she was an ex-wife. She care. She's an ex, but, like, they've been flirting while um, Sophie's been asleep. Because Bess, like, moved in temporarily. She's, like, staying over. Um, and they've been flirting. And I've been very confused, but I haven't been, you know... I've been letting them do what they want to do. Very dramatic. Oh, he's already over it. He's like, oh, I got caught cheating, but you know, this music's pretty great. I'm having a good time. Okay, can you clean up after yourself? So, um, Jules, your brain's on backwards. Jules is very confused about his own love situation. Can he, like, talk about it? She doesn't really seem that mad about it. Really? Let's try and cheer up. Sorry that I cheated on you with my wife. Um, I was like, went to the other room and gave her a hug and some smoochies. Oh, very good. Oh, I'm glad. Not awake enough for a high five though. That's fair. I wouldn't be. Um, we were on a break. Seems valid. <laughs> True. They were on a break. He's literally married with a baby. And she's like, but I thought you loved me. So we need to... Oh, I thought we could take a pregnancy test. We can't? Okay. All right, let's try again. <laughs> um, Josh, hello. Welcome in. How are you doing? Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, I hope you're doing well. Different situation from Ross though. Yeah, slightly different. Is she gonna come in again? She's like, oh my God, they won't stop like woohooing. And it's like, yeah, well, this is their house. Like, what do you expect? You literally barged in here. Do not walk in there. Oh my God. I think she's still hung up on him. And that's like the main thing is like, she's still really hung up on him, but like, He's moved on with a child, but he's got her like hanging on. He's got her hanging on by a thread. Oh, I didn't know who was making that noise then. Um, oh my God, she's not happy. Well, listen, you can leave anytime you'd like. I don't know how to make you leave, but I think you can leave. I'm pretty sure. Um, putting birds for bed also means realize my cat might try and uncover pomet. Oh my goodness. Um, yes, very true. That is an excellent point. Okay, can we check if we're pregnant? She might be sad, but she might be pregnant. Who knows? Bess, you realize this isn't your home, right? Bess has no idea. Bess thinks she lives here now. She's like, I've got free rent. Not again. Not pregnant. Well, this is upsetting. This is making me upsetty spaghetti. Maybe we need to do try for baby. Like actually try for baby. Cause she's sad about it. She wants a baby. We're gonna try for baby. I'm gonna do it. I was like, I'm leaving it up to chance, but um, or science baby. We could do science baby. Can we do science baby with them though? Because it asked me if I wanted to do... Oh, no, there we go. There we go. Have science baby with. Let's have a little science baby. Let's try it out. They've had, like, two failed, so now they're going to try. Um, remember that? Next time I'm sad. I'm not sad. I'm probably just pregnant. There you go. <laughs> We're going to have a science baby. It's happening. It's what this legacy deserves. She's like, babe, are you ready? Do you wanna? Do you wanna spend a thousand dollars of money that we don't have? <laughs> Should we could try for a third time? Cause that do be the charm. It do be the charm, but we've already spent the money. So here we go. Oh, at the hospital.
hospital. She's going to go to the hospital. Okay. And she's going to bring back a baby. Um, make a quick trip to the hospital. Use her and Jules' genetic material to have a new baby through science. Are you ready to add a newborn to your household? I am. Don't, don't bring back twins. Sophie got curves. Sophie do got curves. We know um, I like to give my, my sins some curves. A bit of a booty. Um, hello. I'm running down to bed. Okay. She'll probably barge in anyway, yeah. <laughs> okay, whoops, where do we go? Where's the baby? Where's the baby? Um, thought you could cancel, did I? What? Did I click cancel? Where's the baby? I auto scrolled and the baby is not here. What? Did I click cancel? I didn't, but where's the baby? We spent money. Where is the baby? Does it take a day? I thought they instantly came home with a baby. Whoop, hang on. Sophie's having a baby. You know, science and all, okay. But like where? Oh God, she's not having a good time. But like, where is this baby? Take family leave. Maybe it takes it. I don't understand science, so I don't know. I'm so confused. Where is the child? It's not inside her because she's like going and is she pregnant? She's not pregnant. Oh, and she's hungry. Okay, well, you better clean out spoiled food and then have some food yourself. I thought, she, I thought if she was carrying it, then it would show up. I'm pretty sure they just come home with a baby. That's like the whole thing. I think babies is confusing. Um, I am confused. Okay, you're gonna go to bed. I am hella confused. Have baby? Is there an option to like have baby? Nope, there's not. Can we serve breakfast? Let's make pancakes, I guess. Who would have thought having a science baby would be this hard? I'm so confused. It must be like maybe a day later. Do I need to look this up? I think I need to look this up. Um, science baby. Hang on. Science baby. Sims for science. I mean, we'll find out tomorrow, I guess. <laughs> um, wait, is there, is there a glitch? Um, is it mod related? Hang on. Um, I think it's meant to work right away. We have a bassinet already and there's no baby showing up. Is it because we already have a bassinet? Wait a minute, have we just like spent money for no reason? <laughs> We can't afford that. We don't have that money. Um, yeah, we've we already had a bassinet in the house from before. Is that maybe why? Hang on, I have to look up. Apparently there is a glitch. Um it I do have the updated MC woohoo thing. Um, excuse me, what should I be seeing right now? Um Very suspicious. <laughs> How long does it take? Um, Tommy, the plants baby shows up in the house in a bassinet, but we haven't even had an option to name the baby, which makes me think there is no baby. I said Sophie is having a baby, and she is not having a baby. Um, seems like it's a glitch. Probably because I had mods. <laughs> I should probably take out the mods. 
Um, well, this is a bummer. I don't know how to fix it. It should be right away, and it's not. Um, science is a scam. How long is this going to take? <laughs> Chance for failure. I mean, oh, now it's it's Maple's birthday. Well, hang on. Yeah, I say we give it another go. How much was it? It was. We definitely paid it. Hang on. Twelve hundred. We're gonna do that again. Um, what's the money cheat? <laughs> money. How do I add like a certain amount of money? I literally don't use money cheats, so I'm like, how do I, how do I? Give money cheat. How do I do it? I just want to add a little bit of money. Can I just add a bit? I don't want to add like a specific. I am working so hard right now. This is, this is maths and research. Um, Jackabackaboo, thank you for the follow. Welcome into the Cozy Club. I hope you're doing well. Welcome in. Um, we are going to just give ourselves a bit more money. We're going to go money. Is that what it is? Money? That's literally how that worked. That's amazing. Okay, so we can give ourselves a bit more. Money. Amazing! I just gave myself that much money. Um, it's fine. Now we can try it again. Have science baby with jewels. Let's try one more time. Come on. Um, on The Sims while watching. Oh, very nice. What are you up to in The Sims right now? I rush off, but I have to go to work. Great seeing you again. No worries, Hillbilly. Thank you for hanging out. Have a good day at work. I hope you enjoy. Uh, don't work too hard. Work as hard as you need to. Uh, but enjoy your day. Thank you for popping in and saying hello. Okay. Baby, take two. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to get rid of this bassinet. Maybe this is the problem, I don't know. It could be that we already had that bassinet. Maybe that bassinet was the issue. Let's find out. If this doesn't work, I'm not sure how my lesbian couple will have a baby. Um, you know, I think this could be an issue with me having the, um, one of the, uh, yes. I think it could be because I have um, MC Command Center and like MC Woohoo. It could be potentially that. Maybe. Can take family leave. Okay. Having a baby. Where? Let me name them. Okay. And there's no baby. I think you have the mod too. I think this is an MC Woohoo issue. I think that's the problem. Um, oh God, and the bills have come. You know, we're gonna just have to quickly try for baby instead. Let's just do one more try for baby. And let me give myself the money back again because that was not working. <laughs> Um, trying to learn to play I'm new to The Sims. Oh, you're new to The Sims. Oh my goodness. Um, well, welcome in to The Sims. Um, have you played any Sims before? Have you played like Sims 3 or any of the previous Sims? Check inventory. <laughs> Should we check the mailbox? Are we, are we woohooing? Have we agreed to woohoo? Try for baby, please. Try for baby. Thank you very much. Okay, good. Um, doing Sims 4. So done Sims 3, you know, doing Sims 4. Oh, very nice. They're very different. Um, but I do love Sims 3. I really do miss the Sims 3. Also, let's just quickly check the family inventory. <laughs> just in case. Okay, not in there. But we do have some random things. Okay, but no babies. Um, Xbox is so hard. I can imagine like some of the controls probably would be a bit tricky. And I know there's like no custom content, no mods. That would be hard for me. I need mods. We want a child and the game says no. The game is like, she cannot be pregnant, sorry. I just want her to have like another baby. I want to try the infants. 
I just want infants. This game is really like, no, you do not receive them. Oh God, you're hungry. Um, Can we get her a pancake, please? Oh God. Um, He's feeling unflirty. <gasps> Ooh, let's embrace the change. Sure, why not? You can be difficult. You've already been difficult. You can be more difficult, sure. Um, it's because Bess? I don't even know how to kick Bess out. I don't know how to kick her out. Oh, she just asked him what happened. She's like, what's up with you? He's like, oh, I actually don't want to flirt with you anymore. <laughs> Sorry, trying to murder Bess and Jules. You know what? They can both go. Um, trying for a baby. You should try hard for yourself. We can barely have a baby ourselves, so. She's still not pregnant. Are you kidding me? She's only meant to have one baby. Okay. Um, that's fine. I'm going to blame Bess. Bess, you need to leave. How do we get her to leave? Convince to... No. I want you to leave. Go away. I'm going to tell her to go away and see if that makes her leave. <laughs> Can we not get you to eat? Have you eaten? Yes, okay. Oh, picky eating. Okay. Are you leaving? <gasps> Is she leaving? Was that easy? No. Okay. Can we murder Bess? I mean, we can... Can we be... I mean, we have to bring her to the party first. She has to come to the party. We need to see what's going to happen at that, at that party. Oh, you need to go to the potty. And you need to go to bed. Party first, then murder. Yeah, party first, then murder. Um, how are we going to murder her, though? Like, how is she going to get murdered? How should she die? It should be creative. I don't know what we can do. I haven't killed enough Sims. <laughs> the pool thing is just, like, not creative enough, so don't suggest the pool. Pool's not going to work. It's gonna be something we can do though. Like, can I don't think that we can really do anything. Might remove MC Woohoo if it's a known bug. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I'm kind of tempted to remove it now and see if that changes anything. Let's actually, yeah, hang on, let me just. I can't select her because she's sleeping. I just wake her up and just double check that she's definitely not pregnant. Then maybe we'll just quickly reset and I'll get rid of that mod and we'll see what, if that fixes anything. I, I might even get rid of like MC. No, I'm going to keep MC Command Center, but get rid of the MC Woohoo. Because this, yep, yeah, okay. I'm going to quickly close it and get rid of that mod. I'm not trusting it right now. I don't trust it. I'm getting rid of it. It's going. MC, you're done. Um, testing me, truly. Bess and her woohoo glitch are ruining everything. Um, Blue Piggy, hello, welcome in. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Welcome in. Whoops. Um, MC, woohoo, script package, you are out of here. On to my desktop. Everything else I think is fine. Um... Do I have my settings? I do. Okay. And I'm up to date with MC Command Center, so everything else should be fine. I don't think anything else will be ruining it, so... Let's reopen. All right. Do you want to testing so I don't have to? Indeed, indeed. Um, good things. How are you doing? We're doing well. We're trying to get my sim pregnant, and it is impossible right now. But other than that, we're doing very well. Um, just trying to have a baby and, you know, it's, it's hard. You know what? That's kind of realistic. Some people do find it hard. So it's just, it's just giving extra realism. 
Um, also, the color stitch. You thank you. Thank you so much. The hair or the um, the dress. I'm throwing lots of new colors in right now. Okay, we're back in. That was very quick. Shout out to my game for like loading kind of quickly. Um, but thank you. I appreciate that. I also just realized that I don't have my G shade on, which is really embarrassing. So embarrassing letting you all see my game look like that. It's just, it's appalling and I'm really, I'm really apologetic. I do apologize. Let me put the G shade on so the game will look pretty again. If I, if I can remember how to turn it on. <laughs> I do this all the time. I have a weird command to turn it on. Also, imagine if we turn this on. If Imagine if we open the game and she has she's like pregnant with like quadruplets. Um, also, the projector I have. Um, I have a galaxy light projector. It is the Mirabella. Um, I believe that's the brand. M Mirabella galaxy projector. It was pretty, it was like maybe 40, 50 bucks. And I love it. I do recommend. All right, G-Shade on, hang on a second. Oh, skip tutorial, I don't want to see the tutorial ever again. I understand how it works. Kind of, enough. Um, there we go. Oh, everything is so much better now. Ooh. Everything looks so much better. Is she pregnant? No, okay. Let's quickly bump up her money. Um, hang on. Whoop. We gave him like $4,000. Okay. Can we do the science baby now? If we can't, then I'm blaming Bess. Um, and it's in the phone. Um, so Kellis, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I really am so apologetic. I'm really sorry. Um, I am sorry. Also, how do I, where is it under home? Have Science Baby with Jewels. Here we go. See, the game looks so much better with this G-Shade on. It's so pretty. Um, let's hope this works. Actually, I have one of my other G-Shades. How, how do the other ones look? That looks kind of nice too, but a bit funky. And then we have this one, and then we have that one. And then we have this one which looks kind of broken. So we're going to stick with this. And then I can't remember how to get rid of it. There we go. Yes, newborn. All right. Um, if Pomet was born on the 18th of January, what's his star sign? Would he be a Capricorn? <gasps> Game with Tati, thank you for the follow. Welcome into the cozy club. Do we have, are we having a baby? <gasps> Is it working? Oh my goodness. I don't think we heard the music before, did we? Aquarius, there we go, Aquarius. Are we gonna have a baby? <gasps> it's a boy! Ooh, I didn't plan any names. But it worked! Confirmed! If you try and have a science baby and it doesn't work, um, we can confirm. Take out your MC Woohoo uh, mod and things will be fixed. We have a baby! We have an infant! Well, not a baby, we have an infant, no. We have a newborn, not an infant yet. Um, thanks for having me. Thanks for being here, Game with Daddy. How are you? Welcome in. Welcome, welcome in. Um, have you played the new Sims update yet? Prince McQueen. Ooh, not bad. I need to check, like, some good cars names. Um, cars 2. Besides Mater. We're not calling him Mater. We've got, who's an iconic character from Cars 1 we could use? Sterling, ooh, Sterling, not bad. Doc. <laughs> um, I wanna see all the characters. Show me the whole cast. Let's see. Luigi, um, Ramon. Buzz Lightyear car. I don't remember that character, but okay. What about Cars 2? Try and Cars 2. Um, oh, Owen? No, we're not going to go with Owen. Um, 
Ooh, uh, Rusty. We could go Rusty. Rusty McQueen. That'd be kind of cute. Like Rusty's. Doc McQueen sounds like a sus question. <laughs> it does. I kind of want to go with, um, with Rusty. Like Rusty's. That's kind of where my brain is going right now. Also, Mac. Or we could just try to call him Lightning, but maybe not. Um, yeah, Lightning. We should probably go Lightning, shouldn't we? But I think I'm going to go Rusty. Because Rusty's also like kind of a cute name. It could be called Rusty. Um, not sure about it next week, but I'm seeing what people think so far. That's a good way to do it, honestly. I think that's a good way to do it. Um, I also suggest like maybe looking for it on sale if you... It probably would take a while though because it's not going to go on sale for a while. Um, but I, so far I'm enjoying the pack. I really like the milestones. Um, we're having some like some drama. This, you know, the, I feel like the pack is ingesting some drama into this legacy so far. We've had a cheating scandal and, you know, we're having some drama. So this thing's happening. Um, okay, we're going to get rusty. Thank God that wasn't twins. I did not need twins. Yay! Um, and we went with Rusty. Um, also, King would have been good too. King would have been fun. Um, Doc McQueen, but sure. <laughs> Dog name. Um, what about Finn? Like Finn, Mc Mc that's a good one too. Some good name suggestions. Oh, and the bassinet is so cute. Wait, I'm gonna move it so we can actually see it. Um, listen, I am a Cars girly at heart, so I, I had to go with something vaguely Cars related. Um, you get tabbed up. Thank you, kitty cat. Hello, welcome in. Um, where's your top arm? Um, my top is actually a dress. Drama, it's a dress. Shock, shock. And I don't remember where I got this dress from. I've had this for a while now. It's a nice little summer dress though. Um, but I'm glad you like it. Okay, let's have a look at this baby. Oh my god. Little Rusties. Rusties! Rusties is so cute. Wait a minute, that's so cute. Um, you love cars? Listen. Tati, you love cars? Me too. ka -chow. <laughs> Um, Thank you for the stretch and the hydrate as well. Thank you, appreciate it. Ugh. Look at this. Good job. Indeed. Indeed. That's how it's done. Um, oh my goodness. Oh, we have a milestone with Rusty already. Sentiment. Whole heart. This is so cute. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh my goodness. Um, I love this. Okay. Oh, we're all in here. We're all partying in here. Bess, can you leave? How long is Bess staying for? Is it in the calendar? Staying over till Tuesday. Can we, maybe we just bin it. But we're also, you know, we're going to write it out. We're going to write it out. We need to keep her around if we're going to, you know, unalive her. Um, but yeah, I definitely, I definitely recommend this pack so far. Sleepovers, sleepovers are chaotic. Sleepovers. Sims can invite themselves over to sleepover. You can also organize sleepovers, like you can plan them out. But Sims can ask if they can sleep over. And sometimes you don't know who it is. We didn't know who had invited themselves over. I love canceling people because people cancel me weekly. Happens like at least once a stream sometimes. That means it happens three times a week. If I'm streaming three times and I'm getting canceled every stream, that's happening too many times per week. Oh my god, candy, not now. We don't need more chaos. Mice rights, indeed. Um, but yes, yeah, the Sims will just like rock up with a, with a little um, suitcase and they hang out for a week or however long they want to hang out, which is pretty cute. I will say, I, I do enjoy it so far. Are you going to invite candy in when I specifically said not to? Sophie, why do you insist on being dramatic? Damn, she do not curves though, huh? Sophie, love it. Good for you. Okay. Candy can stay. 
Um, if it wasn't Bess, it would be better. Yeah, if we didn't have Bess sleeping over, things would be better. But it's Bess, and Bess is the worst. Um, oh, but Bess is being kind of cute over here. Is she teaching her to dance? No, maybe not. I don't know. I'm unsure about what's happening. Can we go and... Can she go and meet her brother? What's that? Let's, let's go and meet your brother. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> I want to see this interaction. And I also want to know, actually, calendar, how old... That's your birthday and your birthday? It's Jules's birthday as well. That's awkward. I didn't know that. Oh, and we age up tomorrow. Dang. Infant only, like, newborn only lasts today. Okay. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready. That's good, because I want to see the infants. Oh, okay. You're a picky eater. And had a potty accident. So Mabel isn't doing great, but that's okay, because we still love her. She's still thriving. Um... Okay, what's that? Let's see how this goes. Mm, not too sure. Can we talk? Can she talk to her baby brother? Okay, she's meeting new sibling. This is probably not going to go well. Mm. It did not. She's not a fan of Rusty. Oh. Not going well at all. Um, but the birthday party does start soon. So everybody's tired. Great, great. Everyone needs to have a power nap. Disco nap. Normal nap, I guess. You can nap on the couch. And, you know, Bess can do whatever she wants, honestly. I don't care. She's already caused enough drama. But there will be drama at the party. I can almost guarantee because I'm going to make it happen. I'm going to stir up drama. I don't know how. I think Jules needs to apologize to Bess. If he flirts with her, he flirts with her. Oh, my. Oh, the party. Are we having the party today or not? Party starts at six. We missed it. Did we miss the party? Did we sleep through the party? I'm confused. Where is the party? Excuse me. Do we have to go there ourselves? Is this game still glitched? Is this a glitch? I don't want to have the party here. We can't have the party here because that's embarrassing. Is currently underway, but like where? Do we have to go? Maybe we have to go to the party ourselves? I guess we'll go ourselves. Restart, maybe. Let's go to where the venue is and see if it's happening without us. Um, celebration center with... We are... We'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm so confused. But also, if we restart, we might not have Rusty. <laughs> um, is there a party happening here? Oh, there we go. Okay. Party has started. Okay. Rusty is in daycare. Everything's fine. There's a kitchen. Good. Thank gosh. Um, we do have a chef. Um, and we need to get dressed. Oh my goodness, we need to be in our party outfit. Change outfit. Um, I think we'll go with this one. You need to also change as well. Are you in your party outfit? You're in your party outfit, so you're fine. She's fine. She's crazy. Oh my god, so many kids! Okay, everybody's arriving. You're already here, okay. 
I think this is a great place to have a party, honestly, because there's already people here. But we're just like, oh, sorry, actually, this is our space now. Um, now, is there a chef that will make a cake? Is there a chef at all? Bella's here. Bess is here, of course. The kids are playing. That's fine. I kind of want to age her up quickly. Because then she can hang out with the other kids. Um, cook a cake. Let's get you to do it now. Because I don't trust the chefs, honestly. I just don't trust the chefs. I do not trust them. Um, can you interact with, like, anyone? Let's interact with you. Talk to stranger. And then talk to Marjorie. Okay, she's having fun. Where are you going? Where are you taking that? Why? Okay, sure, why not? Oh my gosh. Who is that? Is that another guest? Oh, that's Nancy. I didn't even recognize Nancy now that she's old. Okay. Um, we are going to call in sick. <laughs> Sorry, we're not well today. It's a birthday party. Thank you. Um, now, where is, where are you? You're over here. Where is um, Bess? Bess is out here. Okay, perfect. We can go and talk to Bess. Let's um, brighten day. And then... Oh, this is all like bad vibes. Okay, that's good to know. So you can't really be, you know, be flirty at all. Good. Um, you can joke about old times and see what that does. What's here? Is there any drama? Fight, fight, fight. Um, we could also start a gathering at the same time. Be mischievous and be mean. Okay, so we've, we're having a birthday party and we've also started a club meeting, so they're all going to hang out here and hopefully be a bit chaotic. If things go my way. Oh wait, is everyone not in the club? What happened to Nancy? I thought Nancy was in the club. I swear Nancy was a part of the club. Well, that's a bit dramatic. That's fine, that's fine. There can still be drama. Also, where is the birthday cake? The birthday cake is there. We need to quickly age her up. Oh my goodness. Add birthday candles. Can we put it there? Or can we move it? I don't want to move it out there. I just don't want, I want everyone to come in and celebrate. Oh, you're just there. Okay, good. Don't read a book. You're about to, you're about to age up. Add birthday candles. Get everyone here. Um, celebrate. Help blow out candles. Maybe. What if we aged everyone up at once? Okay. Can everyone come and celebrate, please? The birthday girl? Nope. She's like, bye. Oh, okay. Okay. Maybe a few people. Do you want to maybe like watch your child age up? Oh, okay. Aged up. Done. Got a new Xbox. Oh, really nice. How is it so far? You know, I've never had an Xbox in my entire life. I've never owned an Xbox. Um, we are going to multi-skill. This is new. This is very new. Um, oh my goodness. 
This is exciting. I didn't know we had a new like child aspiration. I think well, let's go creative genius. Wants to build their creative and mental skills or do we want to go social? Summer, we could have summer parties. I think we'll do that. Okay, let's do that. And her trait will be, no, 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 no. no. Mm, lactose intolerance is not a trait. Um, squeamish? She could be squeamish. She's like a little bit like particular. I could do that. We can work with that. Okay. She's like, Dad, I grew up. Are you proud of me? All right. She needs to go and make some friends. Let's go and talk to Eddie Goth. Enthuse about fitness. No, not you. Not you. You. Oh, my God. Don't go and talk about things with a child. Um, let's play make-believe. Um, everyone needs to eat cake. Take a piece together. Can everyone at the birthday party take a piece as well? The club members can. New controller is smaller than the Xbox One controller. Interesting. Is it like making it easier or harder to use? Um, we are going to have you start a fight. He's basically going to be starting a fight with Bess at this point because she's being a menace. So he's just going to be like, hey, not okay. Um, bit of both. Oh, interesting. I guess it'll take some getting used to. It's always takes always takes me a while to get used to like any any kind of controller. Um, all right. Are you making a friend? You did not. Can you talk to Ernst again? Talk about toys? Can you please like make a friend with a goth child? Because, you know, you're all going to be, you're all connected. Um, discuss interests? Okay. And then what else can we do? Friendly, interest, talk about school. There we go. Next legacy is goth. The next legacy is going to be so goth. Legacy general generation. Their generation is goth. Yeah. I, I want her to like fully embroil herself in like the upper elite of Willow Creek. So she needs to marry into the goth family. That is the plan. What are you doing? Are you starting any drama? Can you start some drama, please? Can we start some drama? Can we fight with Nancy? Discuss expanding the family. Because she's so youthful and you're so old. <laughs> Slap him silly. Sure. Do it. How will she react? How's she going to react? Oh my goodness. The Goth McQueen dynasty. Get ready. Oh, she was not mad about that. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> um, hey, hello. Welcome in. Thank you so much. A bit of a bright dress on today. Um, I hope you're doing well. Welcome in. Where is the drama though? Where is the drama? The kids are all just chilling. Um, where is someone I can start drama with? We're going to fight you. Discourage. Boo. You're so weak, Bess. You're so weak. It's embarrassing. <laughs> um, yes. Um, make the paint wants to buy the expansion pack so bad. Honestly, I'm enjoying it so far. I don't know how much, how much, how many things are pack based and how many are infant based, but I'm enjoying them. I'm enjoying like what we're seeing so far. Um, God damn it, what has happened to that sound alert? I don't understand. Hang on, can I do that manually? Literally, where is that sound alert? Why has it not been working? <laughs> is it me? Am I the problem? Watch me just like fix things live on stream. Um, 
The pack's cheap. Welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Welcome into the cozy club. I hope you're doing well. I am doing my best. No, that's not related. Where is the sounds? Where are my sounds? The birthday party has finished. Amazing. Um, okay, but like, I'm busy. I'm trying to start a fight. Come back here. Don't think about things. I am going to invite her to another fake party while I try and figure out this command and why it's not working. Um, I don't even know where these are connected. I don't even know where that sound alert comes from. So I can't even like replicate it because where is it coming from? Where is it? Is it in my sound alerts? This is the problem when I have things like connected to like trigger fire and I have things connected to mix it up and then I have things connected to um to sound alerts like I don't know where all my sound alerts are coming from so when someone says I can't redeem it I'm like I don't know where that is I'll find it otherwise I'll refund you the points <laughs> can we kill her can we how can we mischief mean Insult. Um. Lie about Korea. Mean. Oh, we need to go to the bathroom. Okay, well, we need to leave. Okay, everyone's going to leave. And then we'll work on killing this. Don't worry. Don't worry. We're not going to forget that. Um. It's cute. Why are these sounds all cute? Where are they? Can I cue them? <laughs> These sound alerts are like ready. They're ready to play. I'll play them manually if I have to. I'll do it. Um, have a kill option on my social menu that says mystery death or something. Where'd you get that from? What mod is that from? Oh gosh, everyone needs to go to the bathroom. Whoops. Um, Universalist, hello, welcome in. How you doing? Um, oh, maybe UI cheats. I have UI cheats. Um, also, Jackaboo, Jackabackaboo, enjoy your lurk. Enjoy, enjoy. Um, okay. Rusty hasn't has returned from daycare, but like we haven't returned. So what? Can we switch control? Okay, there we go. Um, 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 where are my sounds? Where are my sounds? <laughs> where have they gone? Can I just play them? Can I just play them? There's one, there's one. <laughs> And then, and then. Hey now, hey now. This is what dreams are made of. There you go. I got them working, kind of. <laughs> um, good playing Sims 2. Oh, what are you up to in The Sims today? What are you up to? What are your Sims up to? Uh, I'm doing very well, thank you. Other than like not knowing how to kill this sim. Um, other than that, we're going great. We're going great. Oh, and I forgot to end the club meeting. Whoops. Oh no, it just ended by itself. That's okay. Um, oh, and I just realized, I think the other sims left the group because I think you need to be, we said you needed to be um, young adult or adult, but we are actually need to include elders. So now we can invite uh, Nancy back in. There we go. Back where she belongs. There we go. That makes sense. Stare my bear while he sleeps, but he might spook. Oh, little boob. Sims are having glitches recently from daycare too. My Sims just don't know what's going on. Ooh, can we... Um, feed? Let's do breastfeed. Um... You need to leave. You need to leave. This chatting makes me uncomfortable. What are they chatting about? 
Unfloaty kiss. <laughs> Everything's reluctant now. Oh, it's because he doesn't want to, um, he doesn't want to flirt. Good. Yummy Miss. Yes, this is the Mummy Mummy Legacy. This is our Yummy Mummy Legacy. It's kind of just like a vibey legacy, to be honest. Um, Hilary Duff pretending not to be Hilary Duff singing with Hilary Duff. Oh, yes. Um, Hilary Duff slash Haley Duff slash stand in Hilary Duff. Exploring infant gameplay and it's hard. I'm stressed. We're going to have an infant tomorrow and I'm stressing. Um, but yes, this is the Yummy Mummy legacy. This is our Yummy Mummies. I thought we'd jump in and explore with her um, because I I didn't want to make like a whole new family necessarily and I was like we haven't played her for a while so I thought we would jump in and honestly Bess has been causing drama. Can we have an inside joke? Um, I don't know where we're at with see they have good compatibility so they were flirting before but I don't know where they're at now. Um, but yes, I'm glad you were thinking about them. I've been thinking about this legacy all the time. I just keep like not being in the mood to play. Um, I think because we don't have set structure rules, but we're just kind of vibing with it. His kill <laughs> we need to kill Bess. I think he needs to be involved. Can he like make her angry? Can he fight with her? Why are you flirting again? Did they flirt? They just flirted again. She flirted with him. I'm not impressed. Shift click. Shift click. <gasps> oh my. I've never done that before. I've never done that before in my life. Remove from family. You're not in the family, buddy. Oh my. I think she's about to um, die. This could be violent. I'm not sure. I'm just going to like tentatively zoom out. She's like in the middle of, wait a minute. Wait, no, I clicked her. I clicked her. No, I clicked her. What? That was the wrong one. Oh no, she fears death. Oh God. Oh no. She's fearing death. No! <sighs> no! <laughs> we can't plead because she's scared of death right now. You are useless. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm not very good at this whole murder thing. I thought that shift click. Um, I'm not very good at all. I couldn't plan it. <laughs> Have you saved recently? When did I save last? I think I saved before. Oh gosh. Have you surfed? I have not surfed, no. Um, what do I do? Do we just kind of let it happen? Do we just kind of accept our fate? Iron Dog, thank you for the follow. Welcome into the cozy club at the most chaotic time. Um, like, do we just kind of accept our fate? The fact that we're like, he does kind of deserve it. Like, he sort of deserved it. I hate to say it, but he was floating. He was initiating some floating with Bess. She could marry Bess. I mean, I'm not mad about it. Um, yeah, please. <laughs> can someone clip it just so I can see if I definitely click shift click the right person? It must be that whoever, maybe whoever you're like focused on, whichever profile you're using. I thought I'm just, I thought, I can't believe that we can't deal with the fact that she has a fear of death. This is the most useless time. Hang on, can you do it? You're happy? Where are you actually? Oh, she's not even home yet. Can you do it? 
Oh no, okay, she might be able to. We're waiting for the reaping. Okay. Witness death. Yes, witness death. And then maybe... He's just taking his time right now. Whoops. Okay. Plead, let me plead. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so stressed. Kind of hilarious that this happened but didn't mean for it to. I mean, you know what? It's like, it's kind of funny. It's... At least it wasn't Sophie. <laughs> Can you imagine if I killed Sophie? You know, it's okay if it's Jules. Like, that's okay. Um, okay, but like, can we plead yet? I also feel like he's not going to do anything. Is he going to come in? I can't plead. We can marry Bess. We, you know, that's true. That's true. We could marry Bess. Or we could at least like, Bess could like move in and like help raise the kids. And then we murder Bess. Once we have control of her. Yeah. Sophie's just gonna have a tragic life. Oh my god, it's not the time to go to the bathroom. Well, you probably have some time, to be honest. He's just waiting around. You can do anything? This is a really long waiting time. Is it because he can't come inside? You can come in. Is this another glitch? Like, it's literally not letting him in. What if we go here? He's just vibing. School starts soon. There's no time for school. I'm sorry. Um. Oh my god, the bees? The bees? Has she not gone through enough? She just walked home and her dad died. Closer after a fun party. Okay. Something is definitely glitching. This is not what I want. This is not what I plan. I just got to say, I do not understand. <laughs> also, um, definitely glitched. Can we reset him? Actually, can we reset him? Okay. Can we plead yet? Perfect. That's perfect. That's perfect. That's what he deserves. Honestly. Could be a hole in the wall. I don't know. I just feel like he just doesn't want to come in. Oh, no, hang on. Now he's coming in. Okay. Plead for jewels. Here we go. Quick. Don't pass out. Quick. The bees. <laughs> Honestly, the bees. The bees. Okay. All right, will this work? Please, it's a small child. Did that not work? Work starts in an hour. <gasps> oh, she's got to go to school. Okay, it didn't work. Um, <laughs> the beast got the grim moving. And she's like, ew, dead body, gross. I need you to go to school, that's so gross. God, only in The Sims. All right, see you later, cheater. That's what happens when you cheat. Oh my god, now she's a single mom of two. Oh my god. We traumatized Maple for absolutely nothing. We brought her in for nothing. We did all of that. What are you doing? Get out of here. Excuse me excuse me mister and best did literally nothing best could have stepped in but she was like no nah. no thanks okay can we cuddle can we cuddle this poor baby um is he still here yeah he's still here okay cool <laughs> Bess is like, what if I die right now? What if I died right here? 
Should we go away? No, ask Bess to help out. You know what? You could help out. She already is helping out, actually. Um, can she move in? I don't think we're friends enough to move in. Selfish fat rip, honestly. Can she move in, please? And she's interrupting, like, the, she's taking up the bathroom. Now we have diaper trash. We need to get, like, a diaper table organized. Um, thank you for the stretch. Sorry about your loss. Let's get breakfast at Hogan's Burger Bar. No, we don't have time to go and get burgers right now. Oh my god, take her, 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 take her. Grim, this is your chance. Take her. Right now. Do it. Do it. Do it, do it, do it. I dare you. I double dare you. <gasps> He's getting closer. I dare you. Please. <sighs> Please. Oh my god, Candy, leave me alone. I'm trying to convince him. No, he left her alive. That's so disappointing. I'm so disappointed. Um, taking photos of the sim you want friendship with raises friendship points past. That's a good idea. He's like, oh, got the wrong sim. Oh well. Okay, can you go to the bathroom then? Jeez. Um, also, we actually need to wrap up stream because I actually need to go to bed and just look at the time. Um, is she leaving? <gasps> Are you serious, Bess? You came over and caused that drama. And then she's like, bye. Now she leaves. Now she leaves. Bess. Look at her. Look at her. She's like, oh, man. That was, that was sad. Oh, she's gone. She literally dipped. She was like, nah, not for me. Bye. Unbelievable. I'm shocked and stunned. I'm shocked and stunned. I'm speechless. Bess, just when I thought I had like a least favorite sim in the baby challenge, Bess went and was like, mm, actually it's me. Um, oh, well, Sophie doesn't know what transpired. Sophie has no clue that her husband like cheated on her. Or that rather like she was the one, the cheaty. Cause like Bess was like, you cheated on me. But I'm like, Bess technically came first, but like Sophie got the ring and the baby. Um, what time is it? It is almost 11.30 p.m. here. It's almost 11.30. Um, at night. Um, I feel horrible for the tra trauma you cause, but, like, think of the absolute chaos and story potential you've provided us with, you know? It's, um, I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad about it. This is the thing, is that The Sims is not boring. You can't say The Sims is boring. Um, also your dress is very pretty. Thank you. Thank you, my little orange dress. Um, making a new husband. He may not be daddy, but he will be dad. I mean, I love it. Thank you. I appreciate it. Sophie deserves it. Poor Sophie. This is why we're leaving Sophie. <gasps> I can't. And how do I take a screenshot with my... Oh, hang on a second. How do I take a screenshot with my... <laughs> Hang on. How do I do a screenshot with this on? What is my little setting? What do I use? That, okay, okay. I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh my God. I wanna take a screenshot of this poor sad lady. She's not having a good day. She's not having a good day, everybody. This is the face of someone who's not doing great. She's not not living her best life. Oh boy, that also zoomed in. Oh, it's gonna keep zooming in because that's the, oh God, hang on, I need to change, I need to change that um, screenshot. Um, hang on. Let's try that. Let me try that button instead. What did I say it was? Okay, we can do that. 
I just want to get a cute little screenshot. Let me live my life. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Look at her. <laughs> um, as long as he's better than Jules. I mean, that's not hard. The bar's, the bar's like on the floor with Jules. Like Jules was not the husband that he should be. Considering, oh, I've got lag. What's happening with this lag? My God, we have lag. There we go. Um, considering he's like the husband, he was the husband of a yummy mummy. He was not very yummy, to be honest. Um, did anyone clip the death? If they didn't, I think I've marked it so I can go back and, and grab it later. I will go back and grab that because that was wild. Here's the thinking the craziest thing to happen was best believing the married guy was cheating on her. Then George goes and kills him. I did. I did. Um, and I would do it again. Honestly, I would do it again. He deserved it. He had it coming. Got a second kid before he died. That's true. She got her second kid at least. Like at least. Good for her. But good lord, this girl. She does not deserve this. She does not deserve this. Um, when is next yum mums? Next yum mums will be next week. Um, I reckon we'll pick this back up on Tuesday, honestly. I don't know where this is going. I want to know where this is going now. I'm invested in this drama that we've accidentally created. Um, and we need to see the infant. We need to up, um, age up little infant Rusty. Um, you know, maybe Sophie will just thrive. Maybe she'll just be like a yummy mummy on her own. She'll be a single yummy mummy. And that'll be dramatic for all of the other yummy mummies. They'll be like, oh, doing it on your own. Oh, my goodness. And she'll be like, yeah, I'm going to be, you know, an influencer and I'm going to be a yummy mummy blogger vlogger and she's going to be amazing. She's going to live her best life. She doesn't need a man. She maybe needs best reluctantly. We'll see. Um, but he was a bit of an icky prick, you know. Um, did on her own but had a, a BF. She can maybe have a couple of flings, I think. I think she's not going to, like, get married again. I think she's just going to have a couple of, like, boy toys um, or girl, girl pals, you know. Um, um, do her packs? I don't have, I have all of the expansion packs. I don't have all of the stuff packs or all of the game packs. I'm missing a couple of game packs. Uh, I'm missing Strangerville, Jungle Adventure. What else am I missing? I can see in build mode actually. What am I missing? Dream Home Decorator, Wedding Stories. Jenny DeBattu, but who has Jenny DeBattu? And I'm missing a very random assortment of stuff packs. But if you just, if you only use expansion packs, then you're fine. Um, you have Batu? Why? Why? Also, I am really lagging over here. This is a bit interesting. Also, I'm, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to save. I'm saving it. I'm saving it. Jules is officially dead. <laughs> um... But yeah, we will pick this back up on Tuesday. Um, I don't like the lag that's happening right now with my camera. I'm a little shifty about that. So I'm going to close the Sims because I think it's causing problems. Um, and we're going to see who we can rate because I want to end on a little raid. Ooh, if I can open the tab, that would be spectacular. Um, and let's go and raid Alia. Let's go and say hello, see how she's enjoying the pack. Um, I'm sure that she would love to know that Jules died. Um, um, also, where's my... Oh, and we also have time for a little kitty... A little kitty... Kitty cameo. There's Lil. Lily having a little nap. Good for her. Um, she's just chilling. I don't know why she's in here. It's hot in this room. Um, maybe this would be the raid could be, but I think I just want to surprise Alia. Um, but definitely, definitely let her know that Jules is no longer with us. <laughs> um, but let me jump into my ending screen, like I should do when I'm wrapping up. Um, so we are going to wrap it up here. Thank you so much to everyone who hung out tonight. Thank you for all the follows and the chats and the lurks. I appreciate you all so, so much for hanging out with me tonight. Um, we're definitely going to pick this back up on Tuesday. Um, 
Where are all my little messages? There's the Discord if you're not in the Discord. We are doing a PowerPoint party in two weeks time on a Friday, Friday the 31st, last day of the month. We're gonna have a PowerPoint party in the Discord. I'll post all the info in there tomorrow, um, all the details of what you need to know. Um, it's gonna be super, super chill and cozy and a bit of fun. Um, also there is the socials if you wanna follow me elsewhere. And if you are coming across in the raid, there we go. There are the raid messages. Um, oh, they're on the screen too. Um, well, maybe we can amend it to, um, what could we do? Um, I think we'll leave the raid message message as it is, but then we will quickly let Alia know <laughs> that Jules is gone. Um, he do be gone. Why can't I like now copy and paste anything? All right, um, but everyone look after yourselves. Stay, stay hydrated, stay healthy, stay well, stay cozy. Uh, and I will see you guys next week for some more absolute chaos. It would help if I had the, um, the raid like <laughs> loaded. There we go. All right. Am I, am I like ready? No, not in the slightest. But now I am. Um, but good night, everyone. Look after yourselves. Happy time zones. Look after yourselves. Uh, get ready for more chaos in this save file next week, I guess. We're going to keep exploring the infant update and the expansion. And, uh, you know, maybe we'll kill Bess. Who knows? I would love to try and <laughs> get it right this time. Um, all right. Look after yourselves, everybody. Bye.